Cammy's mischievous nature adds charm to our dynamic, making her a playful sussy gremlin. Embracing her antics brings laughter and joy to our magical adventures. Let the fun and mischief continue. Kra, Cammy, Kra, where is she? I must find her. Kra searching sapling Kra. My god. You guys have like the most energetic energy so far. I'm just trying to test out fucking YouTube commands and you guys are like making sa sapling dictate a whole Also, I think I might have fixed sapling, but we'll see. Also, hold on, hold on. Lexi on first. Lombax on third. Rage on second. Hi, Soda Pop. <gasps> Hi, Bishop. Thank you for the bitty soda. Sussy. Why am I sussy? Hi, Inns. Welcome in. Consulus, how are you doing? How are you doing? Hi, T Bloody. How are you doing? Um, hi, Infinite. How are you doing? Hi, Caruso. Hi, Bug. Okay, I think I'm up to date. Did I miss anybody? Hi, Night Titan. Hi, Gall. That's who I was missing. I was like, I swear. Hi, Alicor. Thank you for tagging that message. Have you guys heard of this game before? Bef besides before me saying anything. Also, I, I forgot. Hold on, hold on. We're over. We're you guys can't even see my face yet. And I'm over here saying hi to everybody. And you guys. Hold on, it's a little loud. It's a little loud for me. It's a little loud for me. I. It says according to like YouTube. It's been a while since we've seen you play a scary game. Hit us with your best shot. I know. I feel like it's been a while. I'm good with scary games, though. I have a resting heart rate of 55. 
And so nothing scares me, but I'm really especially excited for this one because it's like gives me like Alice vibes and it's roguelike and I've been enjoying roguelikes. Not until today. I, I think it was an early access or something, but it just recently caught my eye. I think it was maybe on sale. I don't know why. Or maybe it just recently came out, even though a, it says release date was 2022. And I'm like, it's 2024. What that was two years ago. What the fuck are you ago. talking about, man? Wow. Wow. Okay. I'll be quiet. I'll shut up. Uh, not like Alice Madness Returns, Nama says. I love Alice Madness Returns so much. But this is not a 3D platformer. This is a 3D, 2D horror roguelike survival game. There are some Dark Souls elements too. It's very interesting. I have never seen anything like this before. It's one of a kind. I know. I know that timing. That timing. <laughs> You haven't thought about it in a long time. I think, see, my Roman Empire <laughs> is what EA did to American McGee and Alice Asylum. And if you guys don't know, if you really want something scary, there's this new game that's already becoming a hit. It's called Silent Breath. That's a game where your microphone is used against you. Isn't that one? Isn't that one called? Wait, I played that one. It's not called Silent Breath. Is it called Silent Breath? I don't know. I played one like that and I ruled it. It's when I said boobs that I've died. <laughs> but I think they're supposed to have updates for that one coming out. Oh my god, chicken attack. Games like that means you, have, you can't say a single word or they'll get you. Yep. When I played that, when I played, what was it called? It was, oh, don't scream. That's what it was called. If don't you want scream. an Alice in Wonderland horror game with Resident Evil gameplay, try Lisa Director's Cut Krahaha. Hi, Arker. I don't even know Chicken Attack. Am I the only one on the internet that doesn't know Chicken Attack? Because I have never heard Chicken Attack before yesterday when you guys started playing Chicken Attack. Before that, mm -mm -mm -mm. I was not on Chicken Attack's radar. Or Chicken Attack Boop. wasn't on my radar. Thank you for the boob. Is it? It's the best. But I also... I was playing a little bit more Sekiro today. And I still suck. I went and I got the um, the butthole flowers. So that when we play Sekiro again. We're not going to start streaming Sekiro. I don't want to play Sekiro. We're going to be going into Withering Rooms right away. Hi, Ubu. What's next? You'll tell us you don't know about Duck Duck. Hunt? Wait. What's Duck Duck Hunt? I, I touch grass. Hi, <gasps> Sniffa. What's Duck Duck Hunt? Wait, I'm like, seriously. Is it that... <laughs> See, sometimes I have heard of it, but I don't know it by name. So you, you have to forgive me that. Yes. Yes, Uwu, the butt butthole flowers. It's what you use for resurrection in Sekiro. I'm sorry. I, I know. I know things. I know things. I know things. I just don't know those things. It's a game about a guy hunting ducks as a guy. And oh, wait, 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 wait. Wasn't there a VR version of Duck Duck Hunt? A VR version where you could like, and the guy would sneak up behind you. Because then, if it was, then I then I do know of it. Yeah, yeah, I know of that. See, I told you, I know things. I just don't remember names of things. So I know the things. I just don't remember what they're called. I didn't know this. See, I played it. The VR thing was cool. I really enjoyed it. I played it in VR. You got to shoot things, and then. I was kind of not that great. And then the duck would come. Mm. Oh, it was not a duck. It was a dog. The dog would come and try to kill you. It gave me very... 
it gave me very much um uh five nights of freddy vibes it was five nights of freddy vibes so i don't know how spooky uh withering rooms will be but do you guys want me to turn on my heart right because we can just don't expect anything fun just expect me to be super duper calm I've been doing deep dives in absurd indie RPG maker and horror games. I know like seeing games I need to play. Have you, Gaul, have you heard of Withering Rooms before? Or is this also your first time hearing about it? Uh, the dog would retrieve ducks. Wait, then who was the guy that was... Who was the guy trying to scare me in the, the VR version? You have it on PS5? Did you play it? A real scary Five Nights at Freddy's Hi, game Bobo. would be the joy of creation. And I know that from experience. Sure, I've never played it, but it is an absolute nightmare for people. The early playthroughs, whoa. <laughs> Welcome in, Nika. Thank you for the follow. You're now middle time. I feel like I'm, like, so out of it today with my speak. So if I misspeak or mispronounce anything today, um, it's me... Cause that's my brain is rotten. I had no coffee. I what did I eat? I had one meal of food. I fed myself once. <laughs> Hello, Kenny. <gasps> Hope you're doing well. Amra, um, thank you for the honey pills. I'm doing well. How are you? We're about to get into a spooky ooky game, and I feel like it's been forever since I played something spooky. And I always tell people, "Hey, I'm Kenny. I'm I'm a forest witch variety streamer, and I like to play spooky ooky games." And Souls like, and I can't be just doing Souls like if I like to play Ookie Spooky games. Hi, William. Don't worry, you didn't miss anything. We were just talking about what we're gonna be playing today. Uh, but I think the game I found that you'd like is Bonnie's Bakery. <gasps> wait, 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 wait. Can I bake? Can I do baking? Is it like a baking simulator where it's haunted? Ugh. <sighs> You have a test. Oh no. I get such bad test anxieties and I get bad interview anxieties. Every time I get to a test, I always overthink it and I end up second guessing my answers. And and then it turns out my first answer was correct. So I need to so I usually I usually when I'm doing tests, I usually finish one of the first because I go through it really quick and I'm like, if I look back at it, if I try to second guess myself, I will indeed make wrong answers appear. So I usually am the first or second to be done with the test. And then I'm like, did I question, did I make a mistake because I was so fast? And it turns out, no, I'm just smart and everybody else is dumb. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I played the Dead Space remake. Uh, I believe all all the, the VODs should be on my YouTube VOD channel. If you wanted to check that out, Infinite. I I really like the Dead Space remake. I hope they make a Dead Space 2 remake. Um. My friend played the Callisto Protocol and she was hating it. So I trust her when it comes to horror stuff. Oh, I think you, Umbra. I know I am. <laughs> I'm usually good, but I haven't had something something test related in a while. Yeah, I, ha I recently renewed my driver's license. So I had to take the learner's test. And I was so anxious before the test because I was like, it's costing me money to test. If I fail, I have to pay more money to take the test again. I can't afford to pay more money to take the test again. And I passed. I, I made no mistakes. The Cluster Protocol is the Dead Space successor. Never knew we needed. I've heard such mixed things about it. And it didn't look so great for me. Huh? Huh? I know it's bad, David. I was just saying it's bad. I was just saying it's that. But we can't uh, tell. We can't yeah. let Infinite ruin Infinite's day by telling him that one of his favorite games is bad. It's terrible. Hi, Ark. Can I get a shout out for Ark, please? Are you ready to get scared, Ark? <laughs> you ready to get terrified? Also, guys, if you want to you wanna meet our newest mod, we got another mod in training. Bloody, he's going to be our new temporary, well, not temporary. He's our new mod in training. So if he does anything bad, we can whack, whack, whack. Um, but if you need anything, if you need to DM me anything, please feel free to message um, Bloody. Yee, yee, yee. Um, I just checked Bonnie's Bakery's on Steam for $4. <gasps> 
I'll have to check it out. Is it pretty looking though? I never played the game nor have I played Dead Space because I can't handle... Oh, that's valid. Everybody has their own level of... Of... Um, comfort. When it comes to horror. I am like so desensitized to bloody and guts and goriness. Hi, moist. Free bonks? Yes. You can bonk at each other freely. There's no price to bonking. Aw, thank you, William. Uh, graphic. It looks so pretty, but after I watched Teresa struggle her little buns off, I was just like, not nah, for me. So many mods here too. You know, I'm gonna let them take care of the stream today. I'm just gonna lurk. Okay, good luck, Lombax. If I come screaming for your help, please. <laughs> you know, Gaul's useless. He's mod just figuratively. <laughs> Ark's not gonna mod. <laughs> Ark is a desperation mod. <laughs> He's there just in case. When I was eight, my father showed, showed me horror movies and now the horror is like junk food. Oh, that's... See, I used to be a scaredy cat. When I was little, I watched um, The Lost Boys and that used to terrify me. And now I don't even blink at horror. The only type of horror that scares I me is... I can't believe Lombax is dead. R.I.P. Lombax. It's like I can still hear him. Cross, edge, cross. Uh, there's some loose how much blood and gore I can take. That's valid. I don't think this game should be very bloody. It's more stylized. Arcs together strong. <laughs> uh, Kaya called you her last choice. Does that hurt? What do you mean? Ark knows his place. <laughs> Hi, Nin. How are you doing? Welcome in, Unfactor. Unsafat. Un. Satisfactory. Thank you for the follow. You are now my host. <laughs> I can't speak. Hi, Rizio. Thank you for the poopy eyes. I honestly, Infinite, I really truly respect Ark. Ark and I DM all the time about life and shit, and we shoot the breeze. I truly respect him. I just silly. I just a silly, goofy goober. You didn't know? Uh, it's poopy eyes, obviously. It's okay, stay away. My eyes are down here, guys. My eyes are down here. Oh my god, oh my god. Now my eyes are in here. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. Were you testing this one out too? The combo of the two makes it fantastic. The combo. But yeah, I'm really excited to play this game. Um, when Damon showed me it a week ago, immediately I was like, oh. <gasps> I need to play it. I need to play it. So I'm excited. I'm really excited. You did time that perfectly. <gasps> I carnage. Wait, wait, wait. I know some of you guys are checking your stinky level. I didn't check my stinky level. Oh. You know what? That's not fair. I I had a shower. In my defense, I had a shower. <laughs> Actually, you know what's nice, Lexi? It's a roguelike, so every time I die, whoa, console. Every time you die, you're supposed to die. It's a roguelike. It is a roguelike. And I love that about roguelikes. There's no failure in death. It's just what the game was supposed to do. It's like it wants you to die. Hi, Loopy. You know what would be really cool? And I was just thinking about this. This right... This exact second. Whoa! <laughs> I'm not a. Whoa! You look. Look who's stinkier than me. How dare you call me stinky? <laughs> Hi, dark politics. Die equals upgrade a little. Die again. Then repeat. Exactly. Exactly. See, what I want is I want a a rogue like Dark Souls game. I think that would be so cool. Or Souls like with that kind of tight combat, but with every death. Not just do you lose your stuff and you have to go back and find it, but you have to start over. And each time you start over, Depending you build on how up. how much gore is in this game, you might want to turn away lest it taunt your nightmares tonight. I'm not a, I'm not a nightmare type girl. I don't have nightmares. I, my brain is too simple for that. It's just thoughts of flowers and sleep and, 
and that's it. I, I'm pretty easily distracted. I have never played Shovel Knight. I've heard good things, though. I've also been thinking I want to play Hollow Knight. Oh, you're talking to chat. Man, yeah, chat needs that. Chat is scared. Chat is a scaredy cat. I know. Hey, he switched out his tap on. In the shower. Loopy, you have to pick one word, so I'm going to end my sentence with shower. Hi, Becca. Oh, how you doing, shower? <laughs> oh, my God. Shower. Now I'm just telling you guys all to have showers. Shower. Yeah, I made that more expensive, yet somehow people still have money to spend on this shower. You might like Rogue Legacy. It's Rogue like one of the OG indies where your ch children take on your legacy. Shower. I've heard about that one shower. My first roguelike that I've actually played was sort of Ditto Shower. And I really liked that. And that one had co-op, which was so Who cool. Who doesn't shower. like to stay squeaky clean? I know I do. Mm. Mm -mm. Exactly, Shower. I'm not calling you stinky, Shower. You just have to check your stinky level, Shower. Is it? I also am a, a graphics Ooh. whore. So if the game is not pretty, I want a pretty game, Shower. That's why I like... Um, Hades, because it's so pretty, Shower. There's so many, like, hot boys in it, Shower. And this one has a really interesting style because it's, like, 3D, 2D Shower. Related to the shower redeem, friendly reminder, wash your belly button Shower. Oh, my God. I bet so many people just have the stinkiest belly buttons, Shower. Did you know if you touch the inside of your belly button that it touches your spinal cord and that's why it feels weird to some people, um, Shower? <laughs> Just because I, I like hot boys doesn't mean I'm single, shower. <laughs> you can like hot boys and be in a relationship with a hot boy, shower. Hi, Rev. How you doing, shower? Monthly showers at most? No, Richard, please. Please have a shower at least, at least every three days, shower. Hi, Sarah. Thank you for the look, shower. Wait, wait, wait. There's another game you might want to check out. Crawl. It's basically Slenderman. Ooh, shower. Slenderman shower. See, I tried to play the Slenderman game shower and I got lost because it was so confusing shower. A few moments later. Why are you a few moments later me? We're going to start the game once the shower redeem is over shower. Have you seen the animated movie called Bionicle Mask of Light? Way infinite ninja shower. Is that the one from way back in the day that used to... that Way back, way back in the olden times. In the olden times, the Bionicles movie. That was like the first Bionicles movies of all time shower. Because if yes, then yes, I did. I also had Bionicles shower. That's so randomly and off topic, but yes, I know Bionicles shower. I used to have Bionicles. Mostly my brothers had Bionicles, to be honest, shower. But that's what happens when you grow up with two bro brothers, Bion uh, shower. I'm gonna say Bionic Bionicles at the end of my sentence, shower. <sighs> Tammy has a hard time talking, shower. Wait, there was an Xbox game, shower? Did you just say your brothers has Bionicles? I didn't know you had a brother. I have two brothers, uh, Shower. I have a younger brother and, a, and an older brother. I'm a middle child, Shower. I didn't even know there was a game, Shower. Wait, I had a like a CD-ROM that you use for the computer that was a computer interactive movie game, Shower. You just have Ark. <laughs> just the other Ark, <laughs> Shower. We have so much in common. I also have two brothers, but I'm the oldest out of them. Oh, interesting. Wait, does that mean you have a sister as well? Or you're just like the there's just like the three of you brothers. So you you you're just like the three of you. Yeah, um, shower. You have a favorite character in the Bionicles Mask of Life? Honestly, I haven't checked it out, but I feel like there was one dude that was kinda hot, but I know it's a Bionicle shower. Little child clad. Yes, we're forever ignored. You know what? I recently watched a video shower and it talked about how middle children are the best negotiators because they have to negotiate between the two other children. And I feel that so hard, shower. 
Honestly, a sister might have level-headed you guys out there, shower. <laughs> being a middle child and being the only daughter is also really funny because they were really close to each other. But then I had like, I had friendships where I was closer to my younger brother and close and I did things with my older brother, but we never often did things all three of us together, um, which was weird shower. Because I feel like when we were all three together, they wanted to hang out more because they're like brothers, you know, boys shower. <laughs> You're stuck in between two sets of twins. Oh my God, Sniffa. Hi, Night Souls. We're gonna play spooky games, so it's perfect. That's how it goes, a time and sibling relationship. It really does. And right now I'm on good terms with neither of them. <laughs> Hi, beauty. So my younger brother has been in the stream before and we had to ban him because he was trolling with crowd control. So I had to ban him real bad there for a bit. <laughs> I like straight up banned him for like a few months. <laughs> and my older brother hasn't watched my streams for all my knowledge. They, I, I don't know. I feel like I would beat up their bullies, to be honest. I'm a pretty, I'm like a pretty kick-ass person. I just kind of be like, like not put up it with anybody's shit. Like the, the, between the two of them, it's like five years. So it's a big gap. Um, So I think my big brother didn't care about doing anything and stuff. I don't know. So it was me kind of befriending both of them. And for a while, it was just like me, like, delegating between the two of them a lot. So shout out to Shriza's mom. I know! Did you see the art on her, on her Twitter? It's so pretty. I sent her um, the model to actually play around with and move around with because it's rigged. And I sent her a video showcase that I made. They like to joke that... Yeah, I had twins and they got rid of the wrong one. Wow, I'm so sorry, Sniffa. That is horrible. Why can't we so cool? Thank you, I am very cool. I'm the cool middle sister you always wish you had. Hi, Plaggy, Waggy, hi, hi. Wait, is that how you pronounce your name? That's so cute. If it is, if I said it wrong. Yeah, Nin, go check out her Twitter or if you're on her Discord, you can see she posted on there too. Her 2.0 or 3.0 is what she calls it. It's coming out in two weeks. Two weeks, she's her debuting. Hi, why? Is it all good to go? Pretty much, uh, she's noticed some stuff that I'm gonna fix up a little. She sent me some art fixes so I could fix it up. So I just need to go through that, but it's pretty much ready to go. Like, it looks pretty, it looks pretty sexy. Oh, Infinite, I'll be your, I'll be your middle sister. Does that mean, I guess I'll be your younger sister then, because it's, you're the oldest in your family. Welcome in, Plaggy Waggy. I love your name. How are you doing today, Plaggy Waggy? We're going to be playing an uh, indie horror roguelike game, and I'm so excited because it's been so fun. Also, hi, Jojo. I almost missed you there. Before I forget, Shri's a plushie soon. Oh, you're going to make her one without me? Wow. Wow. Speaking of plushies, guys, I have, I've been looking into like companies that do merch and stuff. Um, and I, I, what is the word? I applied to maybe possibly do a uh, merch with Uwu Market, but I don't know. It might take months to respond back to me. I was just like, you know, you, you regret the shots you don't shoot. The bullets that miss, you don't care about, but the bullets you don't shoot matter to you. You think about it. I'm doing pretty good, actually. I'm a little sleepy today, but I'm super excited to play this game today. You're gonna have to. You can't. You have to look at our new model. It's so pretty. No bonking goal. I play with the little Rara we have. Cami has a plushie only for her too. I know. Does that mean you're gonna have one of each of us, and you can keep us together, little Rara and and little Bioweapon? They get to be buddies and hang out at your place all the time. Then. <laughs> I love how everybody just starts bonking, <laughs> bonking. Yes, you miss 100% of the shots you don't take. Exactly, exactly. That's what I always say. Worst case scenario, you take a shot and you miss, you know? But if you don't take that shot, you might as well try it out. Trial and error. Try out something. See if you like it. You know, the same applies to everything in life. Video games, food. You never know if you're going to like this food if you don't try it. 
And you know what? You you might think, oh, I will regret it if it tastes bad. And yes, you probably will regret it if it tastes bad. What if it is the next best food you'll ever taste? Then you'll regret not tasting it. <laughs> yeah, thank you. Thank you. Big brain Gabby. <laughs> Don't shoot violently with your eyes closed, Blaggy! They finally do the silly skit thing that I told you about a while back. Oh my god, I can't wait. It's gonna be so bad. It's gonna be so great. <laughs> <laughs> Little bois. Bois. Little bois. Good night, R. Good luck with your sleepies. You and your damn fucking schedule. He's so like, what's with? Oh, I swear, nobody has more of a freaking G Gen schedule than R. <laughs> He's like waking up at like three in the morning, messaging me. <laughs> and, like, what the fuck? And then he goes to bed at like five in the afternoon. <laughs> but let's let's slip into the game guys let me start it back let me start it up i'm super excited the music looks so good well, let's go over here the music looks so good can you hear this do you hear this beautiful look at this stay tuned for goals upcoming series little gremlins coming to hbo max maybe <laughs> Hugs. Thank you for spritzing Chad Jojo. Uh, one more down already. I know, Lombax. I know. They they dropping like hotcakes. Speaking of a mod. Hi, hi, hi. It's me, little Rar. <laughs> this is what happens when I give my mods freaking their own custom command. Rar. Ow. Why are you throwing Pedros at me? Thank you for the hip yet, so. This is Withering Rooms. Are we excited? Are you guys excited as excited? Are you guys excited? Are you guys excited as I am excited? To, to, to play this game? There's like outfits too. I saw some of the outfits. I can have like a magical hat and all that stuff. We sighted. Wait, a mojito. Can I have a mojito? I love mojitos. I li I really do like mojitos. I like them. Oh, chat. I forgot to tell you guys. I found out recently that mint is really bad for your bladder. And I just wanted you guys to sit with that. Because you guys love mint so much. But it's apparently really bad for your bladder. It's good for your tummy, but absolutely terrible. Not Well, it's not even good for your tummy. It's good for nausea. It's absolutely terrible for your bladder. So if you have any kind of bladder issues, stay away from mint. Why am I if you angry? want to enjoy more Kami content, make sure to check out the Discord. Free plushy gremlin pics on there. Now, crawl love crawl. Really, Lombags? Really? Really? Yeah. I mean, it's fine if you don't have bladder issues, Mint. A you can consume later. You can consume Mint if you don't have bladder issues, okay, mm. Mint? Like, that is fine. Welcome in Zolal! Mint, um... But if you're noticing that you're peeing frequently, you're having issues with your bladder, then you want to make sure you avoid Mint. Mint. Mint is bad, most likely a large amount, but you'll look into signs of curious yeah it was my um physiotherapist said not to drink mint tea because i'm having the bladder issues because i was saying like oh i like mint tea mint tea should be fine right right and she's like no mint <laughs> all teas are bad for your bladder to be honest there's actually not a single tea that's good for your bladder mint also she feet big I mean, if you want, Gaul can post feet pics of my plushy mint. With food, it's always, like, complicated. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. It's not like I'm saying don't consume mint tea. I'm saying if you're noticing that after you have mint tea, your bladder's not happy, it could be the mint. Does that make sense? Mint? It, not necessarily you, but it, if you're looking into it and trying to investigate why you're pissing all the time, mint... 
It could be that mint you're consuming. You wanna hug that fart? Oh my fucking god, mint. We all get wasted on mojitos and have a plate. Oh my god, mozzarella sticks sounds so good. Yeah, apparently a lot of vitamin C is also bad for your bladder too. Brazil, mint. <gasps> Hi, Senor Bonito. Long time no see. How are you doing, mint? I, you know, lemon also not good for your bladder, mint. <laughs> Everything not good for your bladder, mint. I'm, I'm assuming maybe lemongrass is fine, mint. I don't know. But I know that caffeine's not good for your bladder. Vitamin C is not good for your bladder. Fruit is not good for your bladder, mint. But like fruit is good for you, mint. It's just like if you have a sensitivity, it, you have to figure out what fruit you could be sensitive to, mint. I'm doing well. How are you? I think you need to do a lot of rethinking about what I know and what I don't know. That's true. You got to learn more. I'll always be learning, mint. You'd think little Rara couldn't drink a coffee three times her size. You'd be wrong. Check Discord now for gremlin pics. Crawl, love, crawl. Head That's pats. true, Plaggy Mint. No, no, it's depending on the person. It's It can be an irritant, exactly. And some people will be more sensitive to certain things than others. So like you might be very sensitive to pineapple. And if you notice after you eat pineapple, your pee burns, then don't eat pineapple, Mint. Or just cut down on your pineapple consumption. Don't be eating 10 cups of pineapple a day, Mint. Is eating pine cones good? Not that I know of, Mint, but I'm a forest creature. I could eat anything, Mint. Thank you. I've been good, Mint. I've been good. We're, I'm really excited for this game, Mint. We're gonna break. We're gonna break, Mint. <gasps> I'm so shocked. I didn't break, Mint. I'm like... I love pineapple too. I'm not saying pineapple is the problem, Mint. I have no problem with pineapple. I feel like after I eat pineapple, I actually feel like 10 times better, Mint. I feel like I have more energy after pineapple, Mint. I mean, yes. <laughs> Plaggy Waggy, I would call the doctor if your pee burns, <laughs> Mint. <laughs> Unless you had a cystopathy, then your pee is supposed to burn, Mint. <laughs> okay, okay, let's get into the game, Mint. Before we go, it was a mint conspiracy that just Cammy's trying to spread propaganda so that everybody stops making mint chocolate chip ice cream because she secretly, really not so secretly, hates mint chocolate chip ice cream. So if she tells everybody that mint's bad for you, maybe they'll just continue making it. And then, and then, and then, and then, and then, and then she never has to ever talk about how much she hates mint chocolate chip ice cream mint. New game, mint! This game saves automatically. Do not close the game on the symbol is visible, you mint. <laughs> Prologue Mint 1892 in a dream Nightingale is sent to the most private asylum by her father New patient must spend their first night in the gate gatehouse for observation Mint Is this there's a Nightingale first awakens in the dream Mint <gasps> There's our main protagonist she has a bit of a hunchback. Okay, we move. We move. Some furniture can be interacted with. How do we know what furniture can be interacted with? I'm assuming. Oh my god, Uwu, thank you so much for gifting subs. Oh, we found something. <gasps> Two subs, thank you, thank you. Nerdy Gamer and Starchy. Ooh, Starchy will love the sub. Thank you, thank you, I appreciate you. It says two subs gifted. David doesn't know how to read anything. <laughs> yeah, the first one just says how many subs that have been gifted to the stream. <laughs> Speaking of it, I got something to drink today. Ooh, what did you get to drink, Nin? Uh, uh, yes, my, my timer bell is the Taco Bell. To be honest, in my defense, I didn't know that was the Taco Bell bell. I found it on the internet. I was like, oh, that's a dong. I like that. And then everybody said, that's the Taco Bell ding. And I'm like, what is Taco Bell? <laughs> a curious coin with a cross. It's not clear what metal it's made of as a subtle iron scent. 
who needs money in a dream? As the weeks drag on and my own motivation to help the guests act out their fantasies waned, I began to understand a coin is a favor stored for later. We got two coins, guys. Whoop. Look, guys, we actually have a reflection. This game is advanced. A lot of games don't do reflections. Oh, I can't open the door from this side. I guess there's only one way to go. Let's go. We're in the gatehouse bathroom. <gasps> I kind of like the wallpaper in this bathroom. Inspect. A corpse in a cage? It's blocking a hole in the wall. Oh, no, I don't like this. Some furniture can be used to hide when closed. Press Y to hide. Oh shit. Oh shit. Is anyone else getting the same kind of vibes that feels like Alice in Wonderland or some shit? Mm-hmm. Oh. Leave me alone, zombie. That's the idea. That's why we're digging, we're diving deep into the rabbit hole. Apparently we can. Okay. Apparently we can crouch. Oh, if we press down, that's really interesting. I guess because it makes sense because it's a two D. So if you press down, it crouches. Mm, what's up? I'm blocking the game. You're saying? But if I make myself smaller, all my toggles will put me this back size. So there's no point. I'll have to resize everything. I'm the show. The game here is accessory. Damon's like, I'm blocking the game. It's fine. Okay. Cool. There's a clock here. I wonder if I can interact with the clock. Oh, I can. A grandfather clock. There's a keyhole in the front. You guys know what's happening. I'll tell you what's happening. Ooh, a letter. Ugh. Okay, here. February 24th, 1891. Patient Millie Edward 13. So this this is where they put a bunch of, like, teenagers. Symptom? Epilepsy? Inappropriate behavior? What? What, what, what inappropriate behavior was a 13-year-old doing? Emma, age 14. Fires? Fires? Is she doing fires? Is she a... She's like a fucking pyromancy. Uh, inappropriate behaviors. Um, Becca. Hey, Becca. <laughs> um, age 15. Disagreeableness. 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 Uh, disagreeableness. Am I also a dis... Am I supposed to be in uh, locked up because I'm disagreeableness? And headaches? Nightingale Williams, age 15, symptoms pending. Also, I love that her name is Nightingale. <coughs> Press Y to silently peek through a door. Ooh. Okay. We can silently peek. I guess we can make sure that there's no monsters we're going into. <gasps> Hi, Antonio! Hi, Nick! I don't see any... Monsters. Okay. You forgot to turn on the heart monitor. Okay, it's fine. I can turn it on. I turn it on. You guys are worried that I'm gonna... Gonna be scared. I'm not gonna be scared. My heart rate's gonna be a nice, calm... It should automatically connect. Let's see if it does. There we go. What do you mean? A nice, calm seven... Actually, just... This is... Oh, there we go. 69. I was gonna say, that's a little elevated for me, by the way. <laughs> Priscilla? Ah! Um... Did you guys see the axe man? Looks safe. Looks safer than we're... Oh, this was the room I came from! Ah! 
Where did Axeman go? Oh, I was blocking Axeman. It's okay. He's coming. There he is. There he is. Where am I? He has... He has like a bear trap on his leg. Oh, he has a key on his back. Oh, shit. A key in the front door of the mansion gatehouse. Dafuk... Dayfut? Have you misplaced the key again? Dayfut? Should hammer... Uh, I should hammer it to your backside if you absolutely... Okay. We're fine. We're fine. We got the key. We got the key. I don't know if we can... Whoa. I don't know if I can run. Oh, I can dodge! Oh, we got the key! Oh, look! We're outside! I don't know. It said Dave, right? Uh, my lights are off. It's just sunny outside. The sunshine is coming in. I'm trying to see if... Oh, okay. We have a different menu. Oh, there we go. We can run. I was like, how do I run? So it looks like I can hide in the bushes. That's good to know. I'm just opening doors without, like, peeking in. What is happening? Oh, there are people. Witches? They seem to not care that I'm here. You're not supposed to be here. The first witch. Are you a patient here at the Monastery Asylum? Yes. Hmm. Did you come from the gatehouse? Do I want to be truthful? I feel like I should lie to these witches. I mean, I'm a witch. We, we, you should lie to me. Chat, what sound effect would cause the biggest scare? Oh my god. First of all, explanation point scare will s cause a random sound effect to play. Um, yes. Hmm. Hi, Luna. How you doing? Lingering the roses, a pocket full of posies, a tissue, a tissue. That's okay. We all fall oh, down. down. Oh no. <laughs> Pay blocked. Hey, Wald. I'm sorry, Dark. You made it all the way here without an assistance? Yes. Liar. I'm not lying. <gasps> Did you make the same mistake, Damon? Yeah? I didn't know I could talk to them. Way to go, Camellia. They deemed you a witch and they burned you. They did. I mean, this is true. I am a witch. Wait, the room's different. There's a hole in the front. Interesting. What's that? There's like symbols there. So it looks like we can hide in the closet. Oh, I don't like this. That's locked. Wait, we can search. Oh, a knife! A knife! An old kitchen cleaver generally used for hacking through cuts of meat. Normal or physical damage. One bleed buildup. <gasps> bleed buildup? Six poise? Heavy, physical eight. Bleed three, 12 poise. Oh. Chippy Chapa. Can I go now through the room? Oh, they want me to... And then if I hold it, it does heavy damage. And then we can dodge. I wonder if you can upgrade the cutting power and sharpness of that knife. I Maybe wonder. it could cut through bad guys like a katana through an unyearled. Maybe. I, I'm assuming... Can I... I'm assuming they want me to do something else. Search the room for an exit. I tried the door. Clearly that's not gonna work. Huh? 
Hi, girly pop. I'm terribly sore if I frighten you by just appearing like that. I like to observe new arrivals to ensure they're not violently de deranged before permitting them out of their room. I am Margaret Blackett, and I share administration of this asylum with my father, Dr. Robert Blackett. Your name is Nightingale, isn't it? Let me firstly deeply apologize for you being here. Set aside as soon as you arrived here. I assure you, the responsibility... Well, blah, blah, blah. The responsible party has been severely, severely remanded. This font is not ADHD friendly. I am not familiar with your case history, but you may be wondering if that is all a delusion. I am sure it is not. You've been drawn into a phenomenon unique to Monty House. It's a sort of dream or nightmare. Weeks will pass here during a single night in the real world. I'm sure you have questions. I'll answer best as I'm able. That was pretty scary. I'm glad. I'm glad you're getting scared. <laughs> I haven't seen anything actually scary yet. We're still early on. What can I tell you? Um, the mythology for waking up from the dream is not well understood. Some awaken with ease, only a vague memory of what occurs here. Others are trapped indefinitely, their comatose bodies slowly decaying in the real world. Dying in the dream provides no release. You'll simply awake anew. I love this concept. Like, it's a dream that's causing the roguelikeness. Dangerous. Um, as those trapped in the dream decay in the real world, they turn into deranged living corpses. <gasps> Unfortunately, the, the dream accumulates more such unpleasant in a, uh, inhabitants each year. And such, it's critical that you avoid attention until you are properly equipped with tools to defend yourself. While dying in the dream is a temporary affair, the experience is still dreadful, as you must be careful. We, I mean, dying sucks regardless. In order to... Uh, in order to... In order to invincibility... Wait... That sentence makes so, no sense. In order to invincibly observe your early, you earlier, I use the spirit. Oh, invisibly observe. Okay. I can do magic. I use the spirit twig. Simply by snagging the twig in my hand, I'm able to briefly move around as if I were a phantom. In the real world, magic in the pre. Oh my god, Provisance of Chandelance. But remotely in the dream, magic is real! I'm a novice magic user. You'll want to seek out the filthy wrench to learn more. So, this is like Dark Souls, like I said. I'll let you explore then. The mansion configures itself each night, but you should be able to locate me in the study with ease. I'll leave you the key to the room and make my exit a different, different way. Oh, and Nightingale. Don't be discouraged if you die. As you have already seen, it's only temporary. It sounds perverse, but death truly is the greatest teacher. See you around. They need to fix the font. New quest. Mead bar. Okay. I got. Wait, there's like a. Qu is there a quest log? Boop. This is my inventory. Wait, there is a quest log. Find the filthy wench in the occult library. The key can be found in one of the bedrooms and the chest requires a code. Ooh. Oh, you can see my stats! This is so Dark Souls. I'm level zero with 50 health. With 25 points. Time to do some training so you don't get kicked in the cookie. In the cookie? We'll, we'll go kill some things. Don't worry. I'm not afraid. Ooh, boobs. So we can search here. Ooh! Crafting? Occult. Wax color with road. A useful ingredient in the production of spells. What colors were mother's eyes again? Were they blue? Do you think they'll be gray when we see her because she's a ghost? That's so sad. You got this, bloody. Oh, we can see a mini map. <gasps> That's cool. Okay, search. Hardy meat roll. Hardy roll. Healing item. A hardy rye roll with a variety of seeds. Uh, provides a nourishing effect that heals over time. I appreciate Albert and Diffid's mom 
is German. But why must she be so German? I simply cannot stomach any more pretzel bread. I'm done being polite. You found a healing item. So we have... We have the map here. And then we got healing items here. Assign shortcut. Ah! We can assign it to the shortcut! So then I can easily use my 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 bread. I can eat my bread. Um. A scone. Did you guys see that guy in the painting? He left the painting. Well, mirror painting. He left it though. Close. Maybe he can't get in if I do that. The door. Okay, I can't go that way. Hi, welcome in, Griffin. I'm playing. Oh. oh. You have uh, been slightly cursed. I've been cursed. <gasps> Paralyzed. Okay, we need to get the fuck out of here. This dude is trying to kill me, guys. Can I go through, please? Thank you. Okay, we're fine. We're fine. We're only slightly cursed. Remember, we're only slightly cursed. Ooh, a chest. Wait, what? I'm gonna close it so I don't accidentally walk through. Read. Millen. A colorless flog fell upon Millen. Not the deep ocean. Oh my god. I got frozen it. Oh yeah, I didn't know you could parallel paralyze people. Um, in the morning, the city had eight administrators. Oh, this is a puzzle. This is a, a puzzle. The colorless flog fell upon Millen. In the morning, the city had eight administrators, fourteen bakers, and eight lawyers. Then two lawyers burned themselves alive. Um, next, each lawyer butchered two bakers, and the following day, three administrators drank poison. Okay, so the first number is five. Right? Because we got five administrators left. Um, there was six lawyers that killed six bakers. So it's five, six, six. Each lawyer butchered two bakers. No, wait. Two bakers? Yes. Wait. If they butchered two bakers, there would be two. Wait. There, okay, it's five two six. It's five two six. Wait, wait, no, no, no. I, it, oh, there we go. Ha ha! Permanent key. Okay, so that means when I die, I don't lose these keys. That's good. That makes sense. For some reason, I thought for some, for a second there, I thought six plus six was fourteen. <laughs> I was just like, "What six plus six? Fourteen. Peter has spent a fortune on these silly old books about how a summon a demon to one's body. Not sure what they teaching him at Oxford, but I thought I was praying for a degree in classic, not thirteenth-century magical nonsense written by some monk with an overactive imagination. I know my brain." <laughs> Oh, I got a twig. I guess I can use the twig to go invisible, right? A gnarly magical twig is somewhat hot to the touch. Snap to become a spirit for five seconds. Wait, if I become a spirit, can I kill that spirit? I wonder. And are completely invul invulnerable. We can also... Oh. We already have that on there. But we should be able to... Place that there so we can use it if we need to. Hi, Alcor. I got a creepy doll. It's Spooky's favorite. An unnerving yet harmless child doll. Place it to create a distraction or draw attention to something. Oh. 
We also, when we go in here, we can also go there. It has a lot of different menus. So that's cool. So I guess we can place this here. Huh? Okay. How do I place it? Oh! Haha! <laughs> the Wells Country House! Uh, monastery house situations on a hill, Monmouth, um, between St. Ellie's Church and Brian Back Abbey. Ruins has a fascinating and tragic history built by the coal magnate Alfred Monsty in 1869. The house was initially designed as a country retreat before a series of terrible events it became the private resident of the American doctor and Calo Col Col Colera. Colera? 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 Cholera, I feel like I knew how to say that. Cholera clinic and finally met mental asylum. So that's the original of the, the castle. Or the, the well, you know, the mansion. Exactly, exactly, Iron Slayer. Also in an ad, guys. So I'm sorry. Uh, I also don't know how to place this thing. I'm assuming. That. Have fun being distracted. Apparently not so much. Apparently the, the doll was not that much distracting. Oh my god, chest? Thank you for purchasing the Pranazer chest, a unique and exciting new task in the traditional game of chess. Before we explain how much a unit operates, you'll need to understand some terminology. I'm assuming we'll need this for a puzzle or something. Perception. A perception increases the unit can see spirits from a further distance and decrease, increase. Wait, no, no, this explains my combat skills. Perception. Increases the units can see spirits from a further distance and detect increasingly sophisticated hex and illusions. Poise. Unit with a higher poise are less likely to be stunned or knocked over by attack. Speed. A speed value of 115 indicates the unit performs all action at 15% faster than normal. Luck. A luck value of 200 indicates double the likelihood of finding rare and expensive items, as well as a 10% more coin But Wait, that's so useful. I need to increase my luck. I wonder how I level up. Okay. Ooh. Hey! Look, we can just chill. We can just sit here and vibe. 2 plus 2 is 3, right? That's chill vibes. That, we like that. Oh, hey, I, f I found this. This is the study. Wait, I found another doll. Wait. I just realized something. I don't have my... I don't have my... My butcher knife equipped. Anymore. Because I could have stabbed that other dude, too. It's our lady. Our well... Uh, oh. Well, country house. Fred... Mostyn of Lancaster was born the modest means. He managed to build a coal mining empire after he has beset. Why are they using such big words? A small plot in the southeast Wales by his uncle. Like many of the newly rich, Alfred was hopped for a more leisure ast ast aristocrat life for his children. So off went his ruined his twins, Peter and Priscilla, to England for a proper education. In 1869, Monstein started construction on the country home, halfway between the mine of Oxford, where Peter is pursuing his classic degree. It sounds so sophisticated. Yes. Yes, Griffin. The name of the game is called Withering Room. Withering rooms. The rooms that are withering. I wasn't expecting to see you so soon. I believe you'll do well in the dream. Let me give you a little gift. This is an old ring of mine. If you die in the dream, you'll lose most of your items. But s some blessed items like the ring will survive for the night to night. Okay. I guess I can ask her stuff. Okay. Do we want to know about Margaret? I guess we'll ask her. My father is Dr. Robert Black Blackett, farmer, far famed American physician turned well Welsh asylum owner. Farmed, farmed American. I know this font, this freaking font. 
Have you heard of the composer John Sebastian Bach? He's my father's favorite. Don't we all like Bach? Bach is really popular. Bach was given a near impossible task by King Frederick of Puesa. Puesa? Puesa? What's Puesa? Is it Pruesa? Pruesa? Is that how you? That's how you spell Persia? Persia. Okay. Devise a companion meant to compliment Melody on the spot. You see, King Frederick loved to humili humiliate visitors to his his count in the way by having them fail at something they were supposedly excellent at. Oh, he has a mil a mil <laughs> ah! He has a humiliation kink. Bach completed the task, much to the amaze of everyone in the room. Even I first started learning how to play piano at the age of eight. My father gave me the same challenge. In fact, he gave me that same challenge every day for four years. And finally, I had learned enough counterpoints to, to complete the challenge. He congratulated me for taking four years to match what Bach had done in a single night. Hi, Kefalus! My father always aspired to match achievements of his heroes. He just never real, realized that his hero was really King Frederick, not Bach. I never knew my mother. I was born in China, and in the wake of the Second Opium War, my father says he d she died in childbirth, but I'm not sure I believe him. I don't think it matters much. The only thing my mother gave me was a face, which was not always as ass assessed grown up in England. She's half Asian! My father wishes to pursue a full-time study of the dream. <gasps> Hi, Lazy Wing! How you doing? As such, I'll become the only administrator of the asylum. As for the dream, who can say? It was existed for at least 18 years. I suspect it will be with us forever. I only hope my father research will find a way to banish these wretched living corpses. Okay, thank you, Margaret. I feel like Margaret is also like a very like... Like... Mixed. I feel like I've met a lot of Asian Margarets. Is that weird? It's like, oh, we're not going to give you a traditional Asian name. We're going to call you Margaret. Yes, yeah, so the roguelike aspect is when I die, I have to start over. Like a roguelike game. Um, and it, there's spooky stuff and there's weapons. It's also very Dark Souls-like. It's very cool so far. We're very early on. Let's take a peek. I think we're safe. We also can see our map here. So we can see a strange bedroom, bedroom A, a study. So we gotta continue. We probably should peek before we just walk into the rooms, but what do we got here? Blank scroll. A blank scroll, peach apartment, perfect for crafting a spell. Remember, when we die, we lose our stuff. You hear that? Yellow wax. That's a doll. Okay. Okay. Ow. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. I know I'm trying. I did it! I did it! I killed my first creature! And I can search the body! Ooh, I got an empty... I got a... Oh, I got a crept a finger! A filthy finger of a living corpse. She's calling herself the first witch now. Second open war was real conflict. I don't remember learning that in school. I know a bunch of about history. Hmm, interesting. Um, when it comes to history, I read a bunch of books in the world of history, American history, and read dozens upon dozens of dinosaur books as a kid. I, uh, there was a lot of dinosaur books when I was a kid, too. <laughs> it's freaky. What if I, what I, what if I want a finger? Also, this is a zombie. It's a cholera? Cholera patient? Covering them up with a sheet doesn't cover the smell, unfortunately. That's so sad. Oh, I also got some coins. 
Seven second chat. You also read dinosaur books as a kid. Are you sure we aren't secret siblings that were separated from birth? LOL. It's my first combat. Yeah, like the disease. Yeah, exactly, Dark Paul. Okay. Mm, uh, should we eat? Should we eat some bread, guys? Okay, I'm nourished. Let's peek. Oh, good thing I peeked. So much filth. She's cleaning. It's our weird maid. Horrible dust. <laughs> Horrible dust. So much filth. Hi, Cryo! Diary illness caused infection in the withers with toxic bacteria. Yep, and then now they dead and they're in a dream. Cholera was very serious back then and no... Nobody knew anything about it. I know. You know, it's so crazy how much diseases back then that just like ran rampant because people didn't know. Okay. I think we're fine. Oh, we got some red wax. So we got a bunch of different... Also, we got penises. Dust. Ah. She's coming back. She's coming back. Or maybe not. She's going slow. Going real, real slow. Oh, there she comes. Our little maid. Not much of a witch yet. She's just a girl with a butcher knife. Yep, we'll get there. We'll get there. We'll get our witch's hat. We'll get our magic. I need to find the occult room so we can get our first magic. Oh, interesting. She went in there. Okay. Wait, let's search, let's search here for us. Oh, first aid kit! Yes! It also stops bleeding, apparently. Okay, we found the occult room. Um, warding candle. A holy candle gradually heals curse damage. The longer you stay close to it, the faster it heals. Ooh! A table for pressing wax. Okay, so we can use that to press wax. Make our own spells. Inspect. The Night Mother remembers we are he we are her bricks and blood is her mortar. Oh, there's our little occult dude. Let's also hear another thing. This is talks more about our unlike traditional chest. Okay, bleeding. The unit bleeds at a rate of 2% health per turn and leaves a bloody trail for 15 turns or until they use a suitable healing item. Poison. The unit is slowed by 25% and loses 1% health per turn for 30 turns until they use a suitable healing. Paralysis. 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 Um, the unit cannot move for 5 turns. Curse rot. Inflict when the unit reaches their curse tolerance. The unit rots internally at a rate of 1 health point per turn until a warding candle is used. Danger. The unit is near death and should heal immediately. Any magic healing effect cease to work. Oh. This game is set in 1869, I believe. It, those are some crusty feet, I know. They're exposing the feetsies to you guys. Oh, a new visitor to our dream. How exciting! I don't have a name exactly, but most folks around here call me Filthy wrench. I consider myself a tutor of sort of the occult arts. You'll see you would like to make a fine student. Before we get started, I have a small request, which you might find a bit off-putting. I'd like you to bring me a corrupted finger. I do, I have one! I freshly climped from the one of the undead. Thank goodness I did that! Thank goodness I killed that person! I mean the dead corpse. The yeah, easy, right? Now, don't look so shocked. You don't even know what it is for. I suggest targeting one of the sleeping zombies. I appreciate this an unusual and difficult request, but I'm assuming you, you, the end result will be worth it. I have one. Excellent. I won't ask where you got it. Now that what I'd like you to do is eat the finger. Um. 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 
Um, excuse me, occult man, occult man. I'm a vegetarian. I don't eat fingers. Just kidding. <laughs> Such body parts are a value commodity with many uses in the dream as in life. You see the, the shrine in the room? <clears throat> a curious ancient thing. Place the finger into the basin to activate it. It will help you remember items you might otherwise have forgotten each night. You'll find shrines like these throughout the mansion. Just as no two people are alike, so are the shrines. Each one will require a different offering to activate. Each new shrine you activate will allow you to remember one additional item. Return to me pupil once you have activated the shrine. Okay. The night mother remembers where are her bricks and her blood and mortar. Offer the fingy one item remember slot. Manage to remember items. So I basically can put any of this into my remember slot. I guess I should probably remember my weapon. There we go. So we don't lose my weapon after I die. Our lesson will be by casting of spells. You may be susceptible about you skeptical about the existence of magic in the real world, but there is no doubt the power in the dream. Can we just put it and make a fart joke instead? What do you mean? What fart joke? We already got lots of farts going on. We're not eating anything, guys. We're not eating anything. Uh, you may be scared. Uh, okay. Hold this blue scroll. Focus your attention on the seal and imagine it breaking. Will you wave your hand over it? The seal will break and the magic emer energies contained within it scroll is escape. The school bro is a protection spell, giving you an invincible suit of armor that will absorb a few hits before disbanding. There is a price, however. <laughs> Using magic will cost. Uh, cause one to become slightly cursed. The effects are numerous. Interesting. So instead of having mana, you have curse. And when you use magic, you get slightly more cursed. Graying off the skin and increasing awareness of paranormal activities nearby. Next strange and horrifying sights previously hidden will reveal themselves. Anyone has a tolerance for being cursed, which if exceeded leads to a rather rapid internal rotting process. In that case, use a warden candle immediately to reduce your curseness. Enough. Prattle and give the spell a try and see and see me when you're ready to learn more. Okay. No. So No. So we can go to our spells and we can also put our spells here. It's a mess. I know my inventory is a mess right now, guys. But we'll figure it out afterwards. Okay. So, we have the spell activated. We can, we can switch between easily like that. Let's peek a peeky peek. Peeky peeky peek. Oh, there she is. Look at that. Perfect. And then we can continue into the next room. What is here? Oh, coins! I wonder what we can buy with coins. What is this place? <clears throat> Hold still now. Ah! I didn't mean to do that. I didn't mean to do that. Hold still now. I have a protective spell. I did the protective spell thing, it worked! I, I forgot to weave, I'm still learning, I'm still learning. We got a medical herb though, a variety of medical herbs which proper equipment should be used produce a healing tonic. A jar filled with a neurotoxin that causes para 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 paralysis. There we go, I got it. Useful to stop the undead long enough to give them a good thrashing. Groundskeeper. Oh guys, that's the food. That's the food. Hold on, give me one second guys. Give me uno seconder. You can read the what the food says. Also, 
How do you think his name's pronounced? Double tap that mofo. Okay, I'm back. Sorry, guys. The mofo. But how is that? How you say his name? Default. The mofo. The mo how would you say his name? And he got a gun. Yeah. Like what the hell? Aggressive much? No, I didn't go pee. I didn't go pee, Bobo. Not yet. Damon was making food, and I was just telling him that I bought these burgers that were on sale. They were like super on sale and I was telling him about them if he wants to make burgers later. Okay. See, okay, you can, oh. Oh. Ah, wrong way! That doesn't help me. Aw, oh, shit guys, that was waste. I'm gonna die. Ah, shit! Nope, 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 so much no. Uh, uh, Where did everybody come from? I just got to keep my weapon. Open present. Dummy spell. A summon a lifelike dummy of the caster, which will attract an enemy's attention until destroyed health dummy scale. See, th but it's a roguelike. We're supposed to die. It's a roguelike, guys. We are supposed to die. What's a high never? Um, you ran up. You call upon a, a realm to assist me in the. Deceiving my enemies. Okay, at least we got... You see two candles here now. Why is there two candles? Okay, we got a twig. Okay, okay. We gotta be careful. Nothing nothing to do here. Just had the last session of my D&D campaign. Same group knew everything else is coming next week. Oh, exciting! Okay, it looks fine. So new, new, completely new layout, guys. Oh, but it's kind of the same. Got some healing bread. Does that mean there's gonna be? Yeah, there's a the guy in the playing the piano. Let's not go that way. We don't have the key that way anyway. Roguelike. Have you never heard of what a roguelike is, Iron? Let's quickly do a peeky Rooney. There's a zombie there, but that's okay. We can go in there and fight him. Forget holy water. Burn this house of horrors down with holy fire. It's a dream! We can't use holy fire because it's a dream, guys. Ooh! Bandage! Okay. And we got another finger. So we can do an offering. Okay. I don't think there ever is anything in here. We got a candle and wax. We just have to find. No, I was just suggesting that that might be. Oh, oh yeah, yeah. Yeah, it is a roguelike. Which is really interesting because I feel like we don't. I don't want to deal with you. Thank you. I don't want to deal with big boy. There we go. 
I think I'm getting better. I only took a little tiny bit of damage. Oh, and I got more fingers, more coins, more wax. We just gotta find the occult room again. Just pee yourself, you'll wake up. You think that would wake you up? I wonder if that is, that is, wait. Oh, it looked like I could interact with that painting for a second. I also need to make sure we restock. So it seems like it remembers what we had placed on our wheel, which is really cool. But so if you get new things that you can replace them with, you can just put that on there. So you can have like setups basically. So whenever you get those items, they replenish. <gasps> Hi, boss! Can I get a shout out for pause? How are you doing, beautiful? I, I, I love how I'm just... Oh, okay. Oh, it's fine. We're here again. We're here. I wonder if she has something new to say. Nope. Nothing new. Anything in here, though? All the sexy paintings. Okay, we got another creepy doll. I still haven't seen the creepy dolls in action. We also have the twigs. Let's put the creepy doll over here. Oh, we also have that... Wait, we also have that new spell here. We should place that here. We have the dummy spell. You guys, I have the calmest heart rate in the West. Nobody as calm as me. Spirit theory and practice. Stagmatic Miles Carden researched into the unexplained grave. Used the following five fundamental traits. Spirits typically confined to a room in which they died. Okay, that must be the ghost, like the piano ghost. Cannot be damaged or manipulated through physical means. Have been known to assail the living, sometimes causing paralysis, which is exactly what happened. Um, exercise limited influence over the physical world, i.e. making small objects float. Visible only in mirrors for those who are highly spiritually attuned. Okay. So it seems like there's nothing we can do to hurt the spirits right now. So we should just avoid the piano room for now. Okay, safe. Safe-ish. Healing kit. Whoa, we haven't been in this room before. We haven't been in this room. Welcome and thank you for the follow. You're now my little sapling. A chest! Oh, I should have been... I just for a second there, I thought, what if there's like a, a mimic chest? What if there are mimics in this game? A rogue ring, melee ring, a copper ring with an engravement this, 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 depicted on the dagger. 30% damage to melee attacks from behind. <gasps> Phantom ring. A magical ring when your wearer is at 50% curse. A faint violent glow. Why extreme wolf in bed? Hi, Dan the warrior. Welcome in, in bed. <coughs> wow, in bed. How do I equip rings? That's my... My question. Oh, we can equip like this. In bed. Okay. In bed. Let's put this one on. In bed. Actually, let's put this one in. In bed. I made it more expensive, and 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 now people still can afford it. In bed. Where are we in the map? In bed. We're in the painting gallery. In bed. Oh, my first instinct was you to stab sure him in bed. That? I've always sure loved this one that? in bed. Good you evening sure in bed. I'd introduce myself, but people you know, don't generally wear masks if they want laughing? their intended to be known in bed. You sure about that? I've been here for you so sure long, I can scarcely remember who I was previously anyway in bed. I no longer have the patience to beat back the ever growing throne of animated corpses in bed. To be fair, we've been for a very long... Wait, we've been here for a very long time, so we have a lot of points saved up. Don't save up points! Use them! Use them in bed! I need to make everything 
getting more expensive in bed. Everything, we get a 50% increase in bed. As such, I have something of a merchant. I traffic in all sorts of goods and my inventory is always is changing in bed. Patrick, babe, and what a dork. But good is gold if, if a nightmare ball. in bed. A coin is a favor to save later. Oh, in bed. He's the one we can give our coins to in bed. We can buy from him. <gasps> we can buy things in bed, including throwing knives at a pipe in bed. Wait, pipe is a good deal in bed. <gasps> There's also fireworks and poison antidote. Ooh, antidote seems really useful in bed. Okay, this is what we're gonna do. Pipe is slow, so it's like a heavy weapon, but it does so much more damage. So we're gonna get a pipe. Oh, we're gonna get a poison thing in bed, and we're gonna get. Mm, we'll save our last point in bed. And then we'll go to our equipment in bed. This, so the, the knife does bleed damage, this one doesn't do bleed damage. We will put that one here so we can switch between them easily. In bed, and then we'll put that one here. Let's try out the pipe in bed. Oh look, it's not the prettiest thing, but we got a pipe in bed. A candle, remove cover in bed? Pull off the cover? Yes, in bed. Oh no, that's not good. In bed? The mirrors, that's where ghosts can show up in bed. Okay, nothing showed up. Nothing, nothing happened yet in bed. This is just a dead end on this side. The treasure chest in bed. So let's take a peeky peek. Oh, right there she is. In bed. He he sells me things. He sells me things in bed. Let's look in here quickly in bed. Ooh, okay. It's the occult room. Perfect. In bed. Now we can go back and talk to this dude because we did the spell he wanted us to do in bed. I know, what a merchant! He sells things to you in bed! I mean, I wouldn't kick him out of my bed. In bed? To craft your own spells, you'll need a grimoire in bed. It so happens I have an extra beginner's grimoire you may have you may have in bed. You can use the table over there to create spells in bed. Here's a blank scroll. You'll need to find some wax. Come see me when you're done in bed. We have wax, so we can go make some spells. Also in bed. Yes. So we have the one remembered. We'll just keep it. I like that one. So we'll keep it like that in bed. So right now we can combine different waxes and make different scrolls. I only have yellow wax, so I can make another dummy thing. So let's do that in bed. There we go. In bed. I've taught you everything I can for now in bed. To continue your studies in the occult, you'll need to find the first witch in, in the basement in bed. Here is the east stairwell key. Before heading down, you may want to talk to Margaret Black. She mentioned needing something from down there. Be were warned that someone has tampered with the gas pipe in the basement. All the lights are out. Oh no, all the lights are out. So you wouldn't kick him out of your bed in bed? So you would you kick him out of your bed if you're not in bed? Mm -hmm. Exactly, Dan. Exactly. And the basement is not somewhere you want to be without a light. Thank- great. Okay. Okay, we need to go to the study. So that way we can talk to Margaret. She might have a light for us. The study... The study is back where we came from. So let's do a quick peeky rooney. <laughs> no. A little rat sucking. <laughs> ah! There we go. There we go. There we go. There we go. It was a little. Ooh, she got poison leaf. Maid Charlotte, offering corrupted fingers. Charlotte did always like to help in the kitchen, didn't she? It has nice range, but it's a little slow. I don't know how I feel about the... I think I like my my, uh, my little knife better. 
We got a dude who sells things in bed. We got a wax spell and a finger and a candle lies. Mm, I know. I know dark politics. There's a lot of sussy things happening. Wait, hold on. We should have our bread. There we go. And this should be the room. Perfect. We can talk to Margaret. Now that you've acquired magic, I have a favor to ask. There's a powerful artifact in the um, Mincy Munzu. Mun oh. It sure likes to make me stumble over my words this game. That may be the key to escaping the dream. The last person seen there was the butcher sir oh my god the butcher i wonder if there's bosses in this game he's a repugnant man my father hired to help with the search research in the dream i've heard he was seen in the mausoleum recently searching for a corpse to um antamonize antamonize he spends most of his time in the basement studying corpses in the kitchen as you much more are able with magic than i can you venture down there and see if you can find anything out. Be careful, he is truly odious and unpredictable man. Also, have you taken a closer look at the Kuro cabinet in the occult library? Lots of interesting objects in there. Oh, is there? Hmm. I wonder what kind of person the butcher surgeon is. I mean, clearly he was fucked up enough. Yes, Vaughn, we have to celebrate dead NPCs. We have to. We have to take the little joys in NPC dyings. Okay, map. We can see ourselves. How do I level up? I haven't leveled up so far. And I wonder if every time I die, do I... Does the question mark mean I forgot something in there? Maybe. I mean, the lady's dead, but I don't know how the respawn rate is in this game. So I don't want to assume I'm safe. We haven't been in here yet. Okay. Let's go in. Oh. Blow me. Blow me. There's a man with a gun. I thought he was going to come out. There's no checkpoints. I don't think so. Silly child. Oh, you oh, Alfred, I'm sorry. Do I have any other health things? Cause I'm not looking so juicy. I'm not looking so juicy, guys. Oh, I do, I do, I do. Okay, okay. I have bandages. And I have healing item. Okay, okay. For a second there, I was worried I wouldn't have a healing item. Okay. It uses a lot, though. But maybe we'll find more stuff here. I don't know... Why the mirrors are covered. I wonder if that means there are ghosts here. <gasps> Hi, I'm a train! This Yeah, this is a roguelike horror game! We're on our second run because we died... No, is this the second time we died? Did we die three times? I think we might have died three times. Okay. I don't like this bloody bag being here. This does... This is a little sussy. A permanent outfit! <gasps> Wait! A decaying suit once worn by Jer Jeremiah, the handy of the most house of a young man before his family fell on hard times. Someday I will be back in those parties in the day of the King Valley. 15% damage to melee attacks from behind. 10% health vampirism added to melee attacks. <gasps> we can still health from people. And this one, it'll we'll get to keep it when we die. Oh, I look snazzy. Look at me, I look snazzy. That takes me outside. I guess we should go outside to the mausoleum first. Right? Oh, yes. Does that mean I'll be able to save multiple things? Oh yeah, Does that, I have two slots. What else do I want to remember for the next life, guys? What else do I want to remember for my future life? I guess we could save our money. I think saving money would be good. 
Which ring though? Which ring though? Um I mean this is this one seems pretty good. Once I'm a higher magic level, I'll be able to see people's footprints. I mean spells are so far been pretty easy for me to get. This is where that butcher guy is gonna be, so we might get murdered. We might get murdered, but at least I look snazzy. I swear this church was the way, but there's only a wall. Oh, do you forgive me? Do you forgive me? Sometimes I forget that I am in the damnable shadow world rather than the real one. I am vicar of St. Ellis, the nearby parish church, or at least I used to be. He's also searching and fighting in this game. It feels like it's been so long since I've seen it. Never mind that. I've been in the house recently. Positively reeks with evil, is, isn't it? As a warrior of Christ, I had once thought to save the poor souls in there. Now I wish only to escape. You may think it's cowardly, but but spend a few more nights and you'll see. Oh, he might have a lamp. Oh, you see, staring at my lamp. I would be happy to give it to you. But I, I need proof that you are a vigilant warrior of Christ and no, not in league with the foul beasts in the house. Bring me a corrupted heart of those hefty poison spewing sheets. No, I have to fight those sheet guys. Covered in ab abomination in there. I don't have it yet. Okay, we have a quest to do. He also has the basement. The basement is absolutely boiling with sinful characters. For one, though the first witch and her intimidates. Do not under any circumstance be tempted to join their foul coven. We're gonna join the coven! I believe the dream is to test from God to see how we might behave given eternal life. Harness the power of a demon to cast spells does not sound like the sort of activity that would please our Lord and Savior. Secondly, I am the Lord of Savior. The foul butcher surgeon besides down there. A uh, despicable man, I've seen him go in and out of the hedge maze several times. That's the guy, that's the butcher. He claims to be searching most mausoleum for corpse is. He is really in intention. I don't know what you should ask him or see him. See, the hedge maze guy, the mausoleum hedge maze. There's a freaking maze. Used to be one of the favorite spots for the content plant. Ba -ba 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 -dem. What do you mean? We can join all the covens. You're pointless sin in the mail. Oh my god, pause. <laughs> it seems to be you have been hexed recently, so I simply cannot find a way through anymore. Seeing though the illusion requires one to be significantly cursed, something I personally cannot abide. However, there is it is there does not want visitors. Whoever is there doesn't want visitors. The Monoceum site is the center of the maze. Perhaps whoever had hexed the hedge maze has discovered something there. Okay, spirits. In the dream, spirits are tricky fellows to deal with. Thank you for spraying chat. One cannot even see them unless cursed, and being cursed is a rather unpleasant taste to be in. <laughs> taste. State! In the real world, I rely upon my trusty Bible for protection, but in the dream, surprisingly, a camera is the best weapon. A camera? Say such as photography can capture a person's soul. Oh! Well, there's a dream that seems to be true, at least for those damnable phantoms that flint about. Cameras are rare. Uh, I did see a girl about your age with one the other night, though. She took my picture and said she was going to sell it to the man in the mirror. Absolutely round the bend, I think. She looked hideously cursed as well. No doubt she was seeing things. So it looks like we, we can be able to... Find a camera to use. I need to heal up more. We need to go fight that annoying dude. Okay. We need to go fight the dude in the blanket. So we can get the heart for the lamp. So we can go down into the basement. Did we search this? We didn't. Let's watch. Okay. I know there was a dude in the basement in one of the other rooms. I mean, the dude... Looks like they stay dead so far. Like, they don't respawn. For what I know. Okay. I think it was in the bathroom. 
The spewer is in the bathroom. This is not the bathroom. Um, where am I? Where am I on the map? Why don't I see myself? Oh. Why is there a question mark in that bath? In the in that bedroom? Did I not go into that bedroom? Okay, this is the room. Okay. Get distracted by my doppelganger. Fuck, he's not distracted by my doppelganger. Come on. Look at my doppelmit me. There we go. I killed it. I killed it. <gasps> Thank you for the 20 bitties. A large heart of a living corpse. Some of these original core. Hollow raw victims have a slowly growing large over the years. Their bodies have become twisted and grotesque, almost inhuman. In the dream, forgotten what they originally looked like. Oh, he's all big and gross. Pod. Look at my little mini me. Is there anything else in here? We haven't been able to search here yet. Ooh, hell yeah, healing kit. Yeah, yeah, what are you guys thinking of the game so far? I'm like really liking it. So now we have the heart. I want to check the map quickly. I don't know why there's like a question mark next to my name. The bathroom still. Is there something in the bathroom that I haven't discovered yet? Because I feel like it must be, right? Because the other ones don't have it. You know what I mean? But the question is, what did I miss in here? You're enjoying? Oh, okay. Now did it go away? Oh, now it went away. So I definitely did. I missed something. Okay, okay. That's good to know. I like that. That's very Resident Evil-like. What's the little creature doing? What's that little creature doing? I hit it. I don't think it liked it. I hit it. I don't know. I didn't know. But what am I missing in this room? Am I supposed to kill the child? Oh, I found it. The first aid kit. Okay, I'm sorry, child. I'll leave you alone. I got everything I needed. The only thing left is the guest room up ahead. Apparently, I'm also missing something on the floor here. Ooh. Ooh. There we go. We got a doll. Okay, we found everything here. Kill him. I don't know. It didn't have a life. When I hit it, it didn't have a life. And if it does, if I hit something and it doesn't attack me back, why should I be killing it? You know what I mean? Why should I kill it? That's not really... The way we should be playing. Why is the doll randomly equipped and not my pipe? Okay. I still haven't been able to use the doll efficiently. Okay, let's go to the occult room because we have some wax. So we can should be able to make something better. Or at least more stuff. Okay, so this one gives me the protection spell, which is really useful. And this one we haven't used before, the red one. Door hex spell. Place a hex upon a door. Anyone who opens it will be engulfed in a cloud of curse energy. <gasps> That's so useful. I like that. What should I do in this room? Guess kill the one child. What do you mean? That's not what they wanted me to do. I figured it out. I figured it out. They didn't want me to do that. <laughs> Hi, Quack on Quack! Wait, I have... I have a weird, strange urge to, like, save my paper, but... 
We're fine, we're fine. We're not gonna die, right, guys? Death is for the weak. We're gonna go find the lantern and talk to the witch that burned us. Damn. Yes. Yes, give me it. Give me it. Now we have the lamp. Okay. There we go. So we have to hold it when we use it. Oh, no, we don't. You can just turn it off and on. I guess keeping it on all the time is dangerous. I have to go pee, guys. So let's take a quick little break and watch an ad, and I'll be right back. I'll refill my water bottle as well. So let's do this. I'll be right back. My heart rate may go up. I'm just warning you. Don't judge me. I need you to send me a picture of your hands on the D. <laughs> Don't forget. Ow! Fuck. Don't forget. We have little Sprouty up here. Bonk! Smart. S-M-R-T. I mean S-E-M-R-T. I mean S-M-E-R-T. I mean S-M-A-R-T. <laughs> hey, zoom, zoom. Uh, zoom, 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 zoom. Nicholas, hi, hi, hi. The appeal is for viewer retention. It's so I become more appealing. It's you guys give me more devotion and more biddies. It's all for the boy Nana. Boy Nana. <laughs> Is that really it? That was I was that's what I was thinking it was, guys. Alpha Candy Body these nuts. But I'm like, what I don't understand. It makes no sense to me. Alpha Candy Body these nuts. Indeed, dear Camellia, you are quite remarkable. The best? Well, that's subjective, isn't it? I'm remarkable, but not the best! Like, you're my favorite poop tuber. I watch you exclusively while I'm pooping. <laughs> Rah! I am Gramelia. Wholesome Christian content. Content? This is so wholesome. Wholesome content. C five seven zero four four two secured. They do not mess Signal around. Being administered. Seventy milligrams dopamine. One hundred and ten. Dopamine. Can I? Can I have seven? Welcome into the Five Nights at Cammy's stream. We got pizza, pizza, pizza. Actually, we don't got pizza. But we got fries that I ate up. Freddy. Sexy. Is Freddy good in this game? Don't tell me. But is, Freddy's bad in the other games, right? Yeah, he is bad in the other games, right? I'm very embarrassed. But when I first played this, it took me so long to find the button on the wall. Like, unbelievably long. Like, I looked everywhere for so long to find this button on the wall. And I see it right here. Come on. Ah! <laughs> it's so close. There's so many boxes. I can't climb on. <laughs> what happens? Don't look at me. Don't look at me. Oh! Oh, you're stinky. I forgot to check my stinky level. And I'm also really sucking at climbing boxes. Okay. Wait, how do I crouch? No. Oh, thank you. Now it tells me. After I press every single button. Wait, I need to check my stinky level too. I need to check out my stinky. Stinky. Oh my god, I showered. What are you talking about, game? Lucky. I want to be 69% stinky. Chica's cute. I like the pink. I, see, I told you guys, I have too many backlog games. I've never played any MSGs. MSGs? Is that right? Er, MGS. There we go. <laughs> I've never played MSG. See? Chica. I like her little print. Look at the pictures. My fun day. My fun day. Look at him. He looks so scary. <laughs> Oh my god. My fun day. Look at that one up here. He looks so scary. That's not a fun day. Oh. oh. Also, why the f*** does that look so f***ing freaky? What the f***? Oh my god, look how f***ing creepy this is. What the f***? This Halloween display is f***ing creepy. <gasps> look at the garbages though. Through the door. I feel safe when I'm with Freddy, you know? Like, I feel like with Freddy, I could defend and protect. What the f*** was that? 
Chica has been caught eating in the kitchen garbage after hours. The maintenance repair are costly and will come out of the kitchen's paycheck management. You know what? I am Chica, guys. I don't need my own... I don't need my own character. I am Chica. Chica, leave me alone. You looking sexy, girl. You looking hot. I am you. You are me. But I don't want to get murdered by you. Alright, I'm sorry, guys. The video changed because I fucked up. I was trying to... I realized I had to fix the YouTube issue thing. And then I was working on that. And then I accidentally pressed play. And so it switched... It turned off the video, so I had to turn on another video. Hi, Fritz! Hi, John! But now we're back. And we're not gonna talk about my, um, screw up. And we're gonna continue. Okay, we got the lamp, so let's go to the basement! The basement! Boop. Thank you for the boop. I'm just scared the witch is gonna burn me again. A for photograph for photographic dry plate. A truly modern photograph a camera. Okay, yeah, see we'll get the camera down here. Sweet Millie, dead girl, still remember the trick. Open and close any door three times, then step through to the wrong room. What? Officer Rowan Brownsey investigating the potential murder of Peter Mosey, 35, a possible forged will leave family. Are you making me angry? Estate to American uh, physician Robert Beckett. Estate uh, staff report Peter appearing pale and sickly for nearly a full year before death. Peter had been severe alcohol. A sever severe? Severe? A severe alcoholic. Oh, alcoholic. For seven years following the death of the father and sister. Don't listen to me. I'm just talking nonsense, chat. Mr. Robert Brackett and his daughter Margaret had been re residing in the Mosin house for three years. The state staff reported co no confliction between them. Unsubstantially rumors of intimate relationship. No! Oh, wait, 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 wait. Margaret is not- no, no, I thought it was father and daughter. No, 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 wrong person, wrong person. For a second there, I thought it was father and daughter, and I was just like, no thank you, no, no thank you. History of Dr. Robert Beckett. Made a fortune as a talented doctor in Boston, treating unusual cases. Took a trip to China in 1860, possibly to avoid war in U.S. Left China from England to bring half-Chinese daughter Margaret with him. Mother unknown. Unsubstantial rumors of heavy opium usage. Meet Peter... Mosley, in 1878, Robert and Margaret move into Mosley's house. Three years later, Peter dead, and Robert owns Mosley's house. That's suspicious. That is some saucy shit, guys. What the fuck are you talking about, man? What do you mean, what the fuck am I talking about? We got a tool. A nondescript remain of some porcelain can be thrown to create distractions. Who are you? Ah, you must be Nightingale. I've heard wonderful things about you from my daughter, Margaret. I'm Dr. Robert Blackman. 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 Black. Ba 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 ba. Also, guys, there is an ad about to happen. Do 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 ad. Be warned, there is an ad. Good luck. Good luck out there. Good luck out there with your ad. For everybody else who is subscribed, you don't have to deal with it. Rina, no rush, no rush, and make sure you can this black right out your ID. You can black out ever. your ID and all in that stuff. In the history of forever, I think about this every day. I think about this all night long. I stay awake, not sleeping, because I'm thinking about this. Ads incoming. I do apologize for not coming to visit sooner. Oh, I see you're staring at my wound. 
Nothing to worry about. Cut my head open on a low door. We old men bleed so easily. I'm afraid you've caught me at the bad time. As I must be healing upstairs. I'm sure you'll have plenty of time to get acquainted here in the dream. Now, for now, feel free to use my laboratory. You seem like a clever girl, so I'll let you borrow my basic lab manual. Enjoy the rest of your evening, Nightingale. I know, not the ads. There we go. There's the ads. It's coming. We can craft things, guys. We can craft things such as acid jar, poison jar, and tonic jar. And paralysis jar. Okay, okay. Healing jar. Okay, let's make a healing jar, obviously. Let's make an acid jar. And we can make two poison jars. But hi, Rena. How you doing today? Hey, you stay up all night thinking about Gremlin Cammy? Oh, I'm so sorry the cat attacked you. That's not nice. We got everything in this room. I don't know what to expect. I don't... I don't know why it was like all dark, but I guess you can't peek through. Oh no. A new friend. Wait, what? A befouled head. A gruesome severed head. The top of the skull has been sawn open. When removed, mis mismatic vapors emerge, producing a poisonous gas cloud. Poison the holder and anyone nearby for five seconds. Oh shit! <laughs> She's a little bitch! She's so mean to me. What did I do? I got her. I got her. I got her. Hydrocobo, when did you get in here? We got a human finger. That's different. In. Innate? 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 What? <laughs> Innate? Human finger. Um, can't help if someone loses their way exploring their curse. It's not for the weak. Okay, so she's like me. She's like me. How dare she attack me and hurt me like that? I need to put my other spells onto my, my circle y thingy. Got our health items. We got more spells here we need to put into our circle. So we have this one here, and we also have this one here. This one's not as important. We also have the doll here we can place. We also need, I don't know how we, do we have any other health things? We have the healing tonic. No, we don't have a healing tonic anymore, guys. We don't have a healing tonic anymore. Ah! Fuck me. Okay, hold on, hold on. Guys, shit, guys. Wait, what? 
English bad. I know good English. I know good life either. I die. There's some weird shit. A cheap wooden ring covered in blood. Not skill that makes me eff effective. It's very irresponsible. At least it adds. Okay, we have a. We got a gift. At least they give us a gift every time. We got a ring and some coins. We got the lantern, so we can go straight back to the basement if we wanted to. So that's good to know. We're in a bedroom. Okay, let's go. Everything should be getting inside either. We still ha haven't found the camera yet. So we just need to find the camera. Oh, we're here. So... Let me change. I don't want to remember this anymore. I want to save something else. I like this ring we got. So let's save that for now. I also lost my pole. I lost my pole, guys. We have no pole anymore. There's a small passage under the cabinet. <gasps> Wait, what? Man will bait out an attack by dodging at the last second, then heavy attack to close the distance. Use the yellow dummy spell, spell to create a distraction and attack from behind. Briefly hide under furniture to avoid projectiles or charging enemies. That probably would have been useful if I knew we could do that. Cast a red hex on a door or wardrobe, then place a doll nearby to attract attention to it. Use sound to your advantage. Fireworks can be gathered all enemies to a location and choose to run in a good lo no local noise making options if you have nothing else tailor the ring you wear to your preferred combat style to this is like a training area guys this is like a secret training area evasion codex describe a charm to recite whistling wills dodging in momentum momentarily transforms the caster into a spirit, rendering them impervious to attacks. That's cool. We found a secret room. Moonless, formless path connects the past of the present. Light to the candle has opened the path. As long as you do not leave this room, death will return you to this moment. Light the candle. Combat training procedure. It's critical to intimidate and activate the shrine prior to beginning combat. Otherwise, the night will be wasted. For successful training, the initials should should activate the mirror shrine, pull the chain to release the tra training assistant, encourage the combat, die, repeat. Explain to explain to the initiate that if they defeat the training assassins and would like to restart, they can make advantage of the Iron Maiden in the room. Oh. Yes. We can practice fighting one of these guys. Okay. He is strong. I died. But it's okay. It's okay. Okay, I have to pull them out each time. Warm up. The warm up. Exactly. Warm up. Yes. He's strong, though. He is really strong. 
And I don't have any spells to try out here. Oh my god, he's strong. <laughs> ah! That is dangerous. He is a strong boy. <gasps> he is so strong. I don't know if I can fight this guy. Not with the build I have. Also, we still haven't figured out how to level up. I don't seem to have many... We're gonna try... It seems like it takes us a while. He doesn't stun easily. And that attack is, like, deadly. And there's no way to know when he's gonna do that. <gasps> Hi, Jackal! We're getting closer, getting closer. We're definitely getting closer. We just have to make sure we can just stand so we can hide. Looks like I can't like roll through his attack. And I can't. I can't. Oh, I'm actually getting worse. I'm not doing this anymore. I'm not doing this anymore. I don't like these. I don't like these. I need to figure out how to get stronger because I can't fight these guys. I need to figure out how to get stronger. Welcome and thank you for the follow. You're now my little sapling. Okay. Looks it's cool to know that there's something like that in the cult room, you know? We already know about that. We've already discovered that. <gasps> the blind avenger, you are new here. Welcome in. My name is Camellia. I'm a forest witch variety streamer. I like to play Ooky Bookie sca scary games and souls like, and right now this is kind of a bit of both. But how are you doing? How are you doing? I should have looked what was coming. It's dangerous. Dangerous out there, chat. Don't go alone. Oh, shit, it's the lady. It's the lady. You're not new here, bloody. You're tired? I'm a little tired, too. I'm a little tired, too. I'm a little tired, too. Ah, I need to bait him into attack. Sometimes their reach is further than I expect, you know what I mean? Like, their reach is better. But I'm definitely learning, I think. I think I'm learning, at least. I think we're getting- I'm getting better, but... Honestly, I'm... I don't know. We won't know until we go down the basement. No, I'm not sucking. I could be better. Also, do you know- Is there a way- There's- Like, there- Like, I don't know how to level up. Big dude's in the basement. Oh, no, guys. How did she see me, guys? How did she see me, guys? That, was, that shouldn't have been possible. How did she see me go in there? That's like... 
Like, what? How would she know? How did she even know me that I was in there? <laughs> How did she know me climb in there? It, no, look. Due to your stats. It says level zero. And that I've killed nine things and I've died two times. Yes. So... the pa We're not leveling. We're not getting XP. So maybe there's a certain item I have to find that allows me to, like, put it into my perks? I know. She's got a bag in her head, too. Okay, I'll stop hiding. Actually... Do we have anything to heal? Wait, do we- We don't have anything to heal, guys. Oh shit, we have no healing. This might be a quick one. This might be a quick one. Maybe we'll find some healing items in here. Yes! We found a healing item. Good. Yep, we don't want to fight him yet. Oh, I wanted to go in. What? I always forget that I actually have. Like, I could just walk in. We want to kill that thing. I mean, we're not getting XP. Maybe we are getting XP. I'm not 100% sure if we get XP or not. Oh, healing item. Poison antidote. I guess that's the first time I've ever gotten a poison antidote. There's some pretty paintings here. But, I don't know... I don't know... How we level up. I mean, there must be a way to do it if there's levels, right, guys? Ooh, this is a little bit creepier than last time. And there's no treasure chest here compared to last time. I think he responded to you through blood. She was like yours and new, but you're welcome to join us. What? Hi, Polygon! How are you doing? Good evening. We can buy stuff from him. We have five coins. Hmm. There's some cool stuff he has. You know what I mean? He has some pretty cool stuff. Like he has this grandfather clock key, which seems really useful. How much? I need 10 coins for that. He has a puzzle. So he has some stuff that's like special stuff that we need to save up for. This is a curse ring. A curse. Oh, he has an axe! Ooh, I want his axe. We need... Okay, we need more money, guys. We need more money. A ring with a crescent moon painted on it moderately boosts spell damage. Okay, hold on. Let's make sure we have... Something equipped. No, this is poison. Oh, that's not gonna help us. Whatever. We don't have any health items in it again. Why are you throwing things at me? Eek. Oh my god, of course she's like right there. Lord Mostyn will not be pleased. Okay. Search. Candle. Some... 
stuff. Some dialogue stuff. Okay. Let's go in here. Maybe we'll find some health stuff in here. We got more dolls. We should really use the dolls. Oh, Welsh country house. It's not clear how Peter became so enamored with the with two such travelers, he would end up bequesting most in house to them. They were the American physician Robert Blackett and his half Chinese daughter Margaret. A nearby Monmouth residents reported Peter looking increasingly pale and in poor health. In 1880, in 1881, Peter, the last surviving member of Alfred Mostyn's family, died suddenly in a failed heart. Although foul play was suspected, especially after his will revealed Mostyn House was a, was to be left to Dr. Brackett and there was no con concrete, concrete evidence. Good night, Lombax, sweet dreams! Hi, Margaret. Do you have anything new to tell me? No. Nothing new. Nothing new to tell me. Okay. Okay, what do we got here? Because it had relatively modern plumbing, gas, lighting, and plenty of space, Wilson was reopened as a private cholera clinic in 1883. It received the occasional wealth guest, wealthy guest, but kept his house clean and running was too expensive for the operation to turn profit and ultimately was shut down just five years later. Wow, that's not a very long time. In 1888, the, bracket, the Blackets joined the Burgundy private asylum business, which was smashing success. Grand like, I can't believe that anybody would send their 13-year-old daughter to an asylum. Like, you just go to regular therapy, please. Okay. I personally don't think I'm ready to go to the basement. The basement is scary. Ooh, we got three more coins. We should, might be close to getting it. Lord Mustin won't like this. Oh no, guys. Oh no. Steady. Steady. Hold still now. Oh, I got a knife. I got a knife. Okay, I'm just running, I'm running, I'm running, I'm running, I'm running, I'm running, and I'm hiding. Okay. Yes, we dodged bullets, because we are the bullet dodger. Why are you trying to scare me, Damon? Okay. I feel like I have been... The gremlin more than I have been anything else today. I feel like you guys are just non-stop gremlifying me. Wait, search. Ooh. Hedge, okay. Critical, spiritual, warding candle, useful, camera, dry photography plates, Bible, curse, explorer ring, ring of perception. What does that mean? It's... The shopping list. Shopping list. Do I need to have all those things? Oh, that doesn't feel good. Oh. Um, guys, that thing is on fire. Oh. It's just the dude on fire, guys. Ooh. Red ring of... Um, red life ring. Gives me 15% extra health and 40% bleed tolerance. Ooh, that seems useful. 
Right now I have... Which ring do I have equipped? I have this one, which gives me 20% more deal. Let's, put, let's do more health. <gasps> Hi, Nate! How are you doing? Welcome in! We're just avoiding flamey zombies. Whoa. Oh, fucking... A ghost is trying to get me, guys. Oh, cool. We got enchantment. Up to three suitors of armors of dolls can be enchanted to battle for the caster. <gasps> we can use dolls to fight. I'm doing really well. Uh, we'll follow the caster from room to room until it dies in combat. <gasps> That's so useful. Okay, I don't think there's any way to go in the maze. <laughs> so I'm close to dying, guys. And I have nothing to heal me with. I have absolutely nothing to heal me with. We gotta go back to the dude with the... the... Wait, wait, wait. Let's remove that. Uh, what do we want to take with us to the afterlife? What do we want? Let's take this with our afterlife. This seems very useful. Okay. Because we're about to die. We're about to die. Wait. Where are we? Uh, we need to go to the occult room. Leave me alone, lady. We have no health. Why do I have no health items this time around? No, we went too... F we didn't go far enough. The call room. Okay. We can create more stuff. Let's create some dummies. And some protection spells. I mean, I'm gonna die. I have a sliver of life. There is no way around it. I have absolutely a sliver of life. We need to go to the gallery, which is right up ahead. Okay. We have some money. Hi, dude. I need, I need, I need you to, I need you to. So guys, we could buy the axe <laughs> and die. No. I should probably buy health. Wait, I have two? Wait! Wait, when did I get health items? Oh, we'll get the axe. We have the axe now, guys. Uh, we can place it on here and replace the pipe. Why am I just gremlin today? Do you guys not want me to... to be anything else? Oh my god, she's right here. So much faith. I want to kill her. So much faith. Who is this now? Protection spell is really helping, guys. We got finger... Okay, where was... It was downstairs, wasn't it? The... The... The, the scientist room. We still haven't gone and checked. There's still something missing in, in this area, apparently. Wait, do I not have the right wing equipped? Oh, I do. It must be my spell still. 
So I can turn these guys into... I don't have the spell right now. Okay, hold on. But I can turn this guy into... Where's my spells? Did I use my spell? Wait, where's my spell? Oh, there it is. It's this one here. So I use it here and it turns this guy into somebody that can help me. <gasps> oh, this is so cool. But it definitely... Oh, I look, I'm looking hella cursed, though. I'm looking hella cursed. Come on, Knight. Let's go this way. Let's go to the basement. Everything's really creepy looking right now. Oh yeah, save axe, save axe. Wait, wait, wait. Yes, yes, yes. Thank you, thank you, thank you. We save axe. We got to save axe. We don't want to lose our precious axe. Yes, 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 yes. And the cool thing is, it doesn't like... My spirit won't leave me until he dies. So we can't... We used up that spell, so there's no point in keeping that. So we can put something else. What else do we want to save? I guess we'll save... Hmm... We can save with a protection spell, too. Okay, let's go. Now we go to the basement. We're way stronger now. Yeah, imagine he just hung around. No, no. He follows. Oh, look, there's a little kid. I wonder what those kids mean. Okay. One of these rooms has that guy. But I'm not going to deal with him. I'm going to go to the basement. Come on, guy. Into the basement we go. The postmortem ruled Peter's death as alcoholic cardiomyopathy. Although the perfor performing doctor notes some irregularities. The transfer of Mayo's house to Robert Beckett followed Peter's uh, Mostyn's untimely death suspicious. However, given all of Peter's immediate family is deceased, it's not so unusual to be implausible. It's the office opinion that the investigation should be closed. What are we guys thinking? Do we think this 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 father daughter duo is sussy? Because I don't know. I have a feeling that they're a little they're a little sussy. Come on, night. That they murdered this dude for the place. Wait, I didn't mean to do that. I mean to do that. I meant to. Yeah, the murder. They murdered. They murdered the guy. Huh? Oh, it's my my puppet. Yes. I am Calvinist, but that's not so unusual. Not to compare to the occult games, but that unholy doctor and his moral daughters have concu concoted. It was not my fault that I was stricken with cholera, but it was my fault that I dragged myself from the irresistible grace of Christ into the den of debauchery. That must be that, that that guy, that annoying dude out in the, the pasture. But I could not stand to protrude waste pouring from our moral flames in one minute any longer, so here I am. Something smells fishy, right? I agree. Each night I explore the boundaries of this magnificent and horrifying gift. I am eternally grateful to Dr. Backett, though her ass asserts he does not believe in God and, and plain has been chosen to his work. In elegantly, the previous occupant of the house exposed dreams to magic. Cosmic concepts have been cloaked in the false vocabulary and childish significance of the 17th century Charlotte. It will take decades of studying properly to harness this magic. Yes, it is a very fancy way to say, please make me stop pooping. Okay, we can craft some healing items, luckily. So let's equip those. Okay, we're doing really good on this run. I thought this run was going to be like death and dismemberment. But so far, the run has been going better than expected. 
There's no point peeking. We can't see anything. Everything's darkness. My question is, I wonder how fast my little soldier is going to die. Hi, soldier. Soldier boy. Come ride me home. Oh shit. Soldier boy. Oh no! He's like... He dies so fast, guys. I can't believe she killed him so fast. I'm so upset. My poor soldier. What is he... What, ooh. Critical ring. Ooh, increases my rate of critical. He died two hits. I don't feel safe anymore. I don't know why I keep peeking. There's, there's nothing. Oh, this is scary, guys. <gasps> oh, shit. This is scary. Nope. Cup of tea. I need to get away and hide. Okay. Can I? You think I can heal while I'm hiding? No, I can't. He's nearby. He's nearby. He's really close by. <gasps> he saw me! <gasps> oh shit, guys. Oh shit, guys! Um, oh, big lady, too. <laughs> Did you guys see the big lady? Okay, okay, okay. I keep on forgetting that I need to press enter first and then that. And then. And then that. And then close. Okay. Oh, I have curse rod. Shit. Shit, guys. I forgot doing that curses me. Okay, I'm fine. My curse is being reduced. Okay, okay, okay. I can't remember why we're down in the basement in the first place. I know we have a quest down in the basement. What's our quest? We should look at our quest. Find the first switch in the basement. Oh, wait, that's what I'm looking for. Ask the... Ask the butcher surgeon in the kitchen about Monsi, Monsi. Okay. This lady is scary, guys. What was that squeaking? Okay, that was where my soldier fell. And that's where this lady... Okay, this is where we killed that dude. Okay, okay. We can at least see the lady run back and forth. Shit, she's... Okay, she so takes a while to get to the end. She kind of stops at the end, okay. Thank you for the mo magic moon. Is she not gonna turn around? Come on, lady, are you turning around or not? Okay. 
Going, now she's going back. Leave me alone, leave me alone, you little <gasps> fucking blanket. Oh, it died! I think it died for. We got corrupted meat, which is a healing item. Becomes poison. It heals you, but you also become poisoned. Oh, body bag. Corrupted heart. Cut the bag open to see what's inside. I'm still not sure. There's a two. Whoa, nope, 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 nope. That's not what I meant. There's a two on the wall as part of a code, I think. Brass telescope. An old brass telescope is allowed one to see across the room, although the lens is poor quality, so it might be difficult to make out distant objects. That might be useful. Another blank scroll. Thank you, thank you. So that was hard though. That was really challenging. Progress is slow. I have not studied. I have I have no students. The dream has become overrun with revolting disease and infested corpse. That this this testable butcher surgeon transfers the dream into a nightmare and now has the audacity to linger here. He asserts Dr. Beckett hired him, but I cannot believe God would mislead one of these his chosen ones. We need a refresh a fresh occupant free of disease with minds open to Christ's words oh my god and that's where they I guess they started to infect the children to bring the children here okay so, if we're gonna leave out of here we need to be careful for the big lady do we have any other items we have fireworks, we have some swords, and we also have a dummy spell. Do we have the dummy spell placed? We do not. Let's place the dummy spell here. Da -da -da. We have throwing knives too. I don't know how useful... So this thing makes me invisible. We should really use that. I should really use that more. Curious, but there's no handle. Okay, there's no handle there. That's interesting. So we can't go to the server's bathroom. anything to really do anything. We have this dude to distract. Doesn't seem like they want to do anything. Reach the toilet. Yeah, let's reach the toilet. What's in the toilet? You found a rusty cage key. Oh, that's useful. I've been poisoned. I've been poisoned, guys. I've been poisoned. Oh, my, my... This is not a good room to be in. I've been poisoned twice. I've been poisoned twice. Let me out. Let me out. Did they see me? Do they know where I am? Why am I a gremlin again? They found me. Uh, 
They found me again. Hold on one second. I can't believe we died again. Ba 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 ba. Ripperoni. At least we got to keep our axe. Kishu, thank you for the resubscription. Twenty months. Let's go. I keep dying. Oh, I got a shield. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Now we can use our shield to really, like, work hard and fight better. We got an axe and a shield. So there's definitely a key we need to get. We need to buy that key. I can't remember how much we needed. Have I tried not to die? I've really tried really hard not to die. I don't want to accidentally walk into the forest. Ooh, a cursed ring? I feel like we had that one before. Yeah, we had that one before. Keeping this one equipped. At least we got that one. That's that's nice that that's permanent. But we got new something to make. We still can't kill the ghost back there with the camera yet. I can't I so I I can't use the shield in the basement, sadly. Great. Perfect aim. Oh my god. Uh, we're gonna die, guys. We're gonna die. <laughs> and we dead. Fastest run yet! There goes my shield. I guess that's not an issue anymore. Guess we got the lantern back. Protective ring. Receive 15% less physical damage. Oh, that's nice. That's nice. Less damage sounds good. That guy with the gun is so strong. He's so strong. I was so sure I'd be strong too, but I wasn't. Okay, what's in here? What's this room? Oh, that room. Okay. We don't have anything to make spells with yet. Sadly. Sadly, we can't make anything yet, but we can try to harvest as much as we can. I need to try using the spirit twig more often. Because I feel like the spirit twig would be really useful. What's this? Seems safe in here. Yeah, just your usual zombie. Those are manageable. I don't know how much coin we need to get the... Hi, diamond! It's like with every Souls game, I have to learn how to do it. Luckily, because it's a roguelike, you're designed to die so many times. It doesn't stress me out as much as normally dying does. I feel like I heard her. Maybe I'm wrong. What's my menu, my map looking like? We got bedroom A. Thank you. Why is she not? Of course, as soon as I, I, I leave, she's going to be in my face.
Okay, another plain bedroom guy. I just need to avoid going into the room with the guy with the gun. These guys get stunned easier, which is nice. Because the other dudes seem to not stun at all, which is not fear. I want to stun people. I like to stun people. Okay, how much money do we have? How do I see? I guess my currency? Nine. I think we're close to getting the key. I think we need ten for the key. For the clock. Because I'm really curious what that's going to give me. I'm hungry. Maybe you're channeling my hunger. I haven't eaten a enough, to be honest. Oh, let's go in here. I think... I think what that means, that little symbol at top, it means it's protected. It means it's a safe area and monsters can't get here. Suck. You want me to be a little say-so angel? Why would you want me to be a little say-so angel? No cussing? Why would anybody want that? She has nothing else to say, so... Yep. Nothing, nothing. Let's continue. Quick little peek. I swear, she's supposed to be here. They're giving us a good amount of stuff. Okay, we don't go in the bathroom. The bathroom is scary with the poison dudes. There we go. This one where we want to go. This is where we want to be. What do we got here? We got a ring of life and a ruffian ring. Let's see if we can buy the father clock. Good evening. This is the worst. We are one short. Okay, we're gonna come back. We'll be back. We'll be back, dude. Uh, even if I have to kill things, I will come back. I need one more. Okay. I couldn't think of a more horrible job if I wanted to. And you have to do it. You have to, or I'll fire you. Do you understand? Good. Wow, okay. I'm poisoned, guys. But at least he, he, he is, is bleed damaged. Here we go. Maybe we'll find some antidotes in here. Nope, no antidotes. No antidotes. Oh no. I might regret what I did. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. It's fine, right guys? It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. We'll just... Ay, 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 ay. Ay, 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 ay. Maybe she'll drop poison antidote. Come on, give me that antidote, baby. <gasps> she did! She did! Oh, apparently, I'm no longer poisoned. Guys, apparently, I'm no longer poisoned. Apparently. This is... This bedroom is... We haven't... Okay, that's where that dude is. We're not going in there. That's where the gun boy is. Okay. Okay. I know what we need to do. First thing is... Do we have enough coin? We have 21 coin! What? How did that happen? Where did we... 
we get 21 coin from? Make a few healing those. I like those. I haven't really gotten much success with those. What do you mean, where's Gremlin? She transformed back! Did we see any? Okay. Now we can go this way. And we can buy the key! We can finally find out what that magical key is for. Place your bets. What do you think is going to be in the grandfather clock? We can buy the key. And we can buy this apparatus. It's permanent treasure, so we can buy it. A head ornament? It could be. It could be a hat. There's a possibility of that. Oh, my halo. I need to remove it because you guys... Fuck, messed with it. So, into the garbage. Into the garbage! Into the garbage! Ooh la la! Garbage halo! Okay. Let's find out! Let's find out what's in! I mean, I'm excited. I want to know. It's the strange bedroom. That's where we came from. Okay. Set the clock? Is it the clock to midnight? What does that mean? What does that mean? What does setting the clock to midnight do? Hold still, <gasps> what? Got you now. Hold still now. What did doing that do? What did setting the clock to midnight do? It just made him leave the room? Is that what it did? That's really strange. Isn't that really strange, guys? It's probably later on that we need to figure it out. Hmm. Clock calls the time. Yeah, but... But that doesn't help us. That doesn't really help us. No. I know, exactly. No, it doesn't. We have any more- we have two more protection spells. So let's activate one. Before we go down. So we're in the new area now. No! Oh, why did you crawl up? Don't crawl up, you little. Distract them. Where did she go? Also, Fancy yourself at night. Oh, you little annoying piece of trash. Stay here.
She keeps hiding. There we go. We got her. We got her. We got her. She's dead. She's dead. There's an ad. What did we get? Okay. We're a little bit. We're we're a little corrupted. Do we have any candles to sit on? Yes, candles to sit on. Do we have any candles to sit on? We actually don't have any candles, which is really surprising. Oh wait, no we do. Look, we're sitting on the candle. And then the scary stuff goes away. You survived? You back from the ad? I think I'm gonna go... Wait. Bobo, has it been two hours? <laughs> has it been two hours since I peed? I don't think it has, has it? Has it? Oh, heck. Yeah. Yeah. I I feel like it hasn't been long enough to. Yeah, that's what I thought. It's just my body being a little son of a bitch that it is. I'm scared of this. I'm scared of the basement. There's a four down here. I'm scared of the basement. There's just a the enemies are just too strong. A new Fancy yourself a knight. There we go. That was a lot better. We got empty things, we got fingers. I don't know what we're gonna use a human finger for, but we got it. Okay, we got the first number is a four. Some herbs. Okay, maybe we can make some more herb tonics. No, we're not eating fingies. Oh, big lady's right there. was dangerous. Hey. Okay. okay, it's fine. We're fine, we're fine, we're fine, we're fine, we're fine, we're fine, guys. We're fine, we're fine, we're fine. Once we kill the big lady, the big lady won't become a problem anymore. The big lady won't become a problem anymore. Once we're fine, Big lady will be dead. Where'd the big lady go? Are you sure about that? John Cena. Yes. Yes, I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm fine. Big lady will be gone. She won't be a problem soon enough, okay? We also have coffee, guys. We're just gonna have a quick little cup of coffee. The curse is going away. We are caffeinated, which can never be a bad thing. We got cursed liver, giant maid, Tara. No. Oh, I smell delicious food. It had 120 health.
Where are we at? We still have a lot of the map to go through. Oh, we're in a storage area. This is like a protected area. Protective ring. Ten, uh, plus 100... Uh, plus 10%. We just need more protective spells. We got to find a, another occult room. Ooh, permanent treasure. Coin purse. A coin purse dyed red with blood and power. Uh, na Protection normally room? all... That's what she said. What do you mean that's what she said? Normally all possessions are lost upon death in the dream, but the purse will safely... Preserve 10 coins. <gasps> nice. Now we'll at least have 10 coins. That's cool. What else is in here? This is a protection spell. So we're safe in here. Hi, sir. I know what you're thinking. Why would this gentleman and his dog be locked up if they hadn't done something nefarious? Surely this man murdered someone and his great beast of a dog dragged the body into a lake. Well, I can assure you, we are merely the victim of a cruel jab and no more. My name is Felix, and this is my noble hound, Hor Horash? Horace? Horace? Hor Horace? If you would be so kind as to fetch the rusty cage key, I'm sure it would be, be of great use to us. Wait, I feel like I knew- where- wait, did we- 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 did we get the rusty cage key already? Yeah, we did. You will not regret this, not one bit. I feel like I'm gonna regret this. Let us dust ourselves off and we'll meet you upstairs in the study. I... F I feel like... I feel like I'm gonna regret this. We also got more rings. What is the ring I currently have equipped on right now? We have the max health and 25% bleed resistance. We could get max health and max curse tolerance. Max health, max bleed tolerance. Oh, that's way better version. Let's equip that. We also have curse ring. Damage dealt by a wearer has enchanted by double. We have a lot of different rings. These are protective rings. It wasn't worth it. Good night, Griffin. So far, it's not... So we don't have the door for this room. Oh my god, Egg! Thank you for the resubscription with Prime Gaming! That's okay. Now you are subbed. Now you are subbed. How are you? We're gonna go in here. Oh, this is the laboratory. Perfect. We need to get in here and find this laboratory anyway. You're doing good? Yay, I'm glad. We're playing this really cool indie rogue horror-like horror game. Okay, there's paralysis. I want to make medications first. They're the most important thing. I want to try the paralysis thing. Because I think that'd be cool. We could also make a few acid jars. Let's... Let's equip this one here. I should set it up that one one of these is like attack, one of these is defense, but you know, I don't have enough stuff yet. Um, and then we also got projectiles, so we have paralysis. I just gotta make sure I don't act accidentally activate paralysis when I want. We need more protection spells too. When I want health. Interesting, That's right? That's what she said. Oh my god. I should really be using the sneaky tool. Oh wait, we found the wine cellar! We do like a good wine cellar. I think I'm doing- I think I'm making good progress, but I'm not 100% sure. What do we want? What are we offering? 
Ah, uh, corrupted heart. Perfect. That worked out. Now we have one more remembering slot. What do we want to remember into our next life? Are one of these rings worth it? Um, zombie pandemic! Welcome in, raiders! Hi, hi, hi! Welcome, welcome! Hi, hi, hi! My name is Camellia. You can call me Cammy. I'm a forest rich variety streamer. I like to play ooky spooky games and souls like right now we're playing. Oh, whoa, whoa, double raid. Right now we are playing um, a indie horror roguelike game called Withering Room. How was your stream, zombie? And as well as Ombra, how was your stream? Welcome in, Scarlet. Thank you for the follow. You're now my little sapling. Hi, hi. Ooh, don't. Wait, were you guys playing Don't Starve Together? Was this a quinky day? Were you guys playing together? You can call, you, I mean, you can call me potato. I just won't respond to that. <laughs> but welcome in, Marshy. Oh my God, how was Don't Starve? I'm really bad at the game. I'm super bad. They were awesome, awesome. This is a really cool game too. If you guys Ooh. like roguelikes and you like horror. <laughs> welcome in, Jota. You are here with Camellia, me, Cammy. I'm doing great. I've been looking forward to playing this game all week. It was so much fun playing some Don't Starve. It just started up not play forever. Oh, I haven't ever played the game. Also, thank you for the follow, Zombie Pandemic. Also, Marshy, welcome in as well. Thank you, thank you. You're now my little saplings. Why are you making me look derpy, Dark Politics? You want to show off this derpy place? But hi, hi. Also, Raiders, welcome in. Um, raids, streamers, if you need to raid and dash, please do so. They're showing you guys my censored feet. Chat likes to do that. Chat likes to spam things. Be like, look at how how silly Cammy is. Blah, 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 blah. I know I'm silly. I know I am. No, no, no feet, Sneefers. Welcome this in right here performance. Is my Thank you for the follow. Ever. Oh, yeah, you the are. History of forever. I think about oh, this every day. Yeah, I think about this all night long. I Rag, stay awake. Welcome in. Thank you for the follow. You're now my this. little sapling. He's pointing towards my boobs. I swear, guys. Twitch, please. I want to check out the new person Zombie just dropped me off with. Wait, what is Twitch doing, Lily? What is Twitch doing to you? Do I need a bong, Twitch? Can we do explanation point bongs at Twitch? <laughs> We like to troll her with the effects. Yes, you do. You do. And Dark Politics is new, and he's already knows the law of the this stream. This many saplings in one video? Girl, I think you're going places. Thank you for the follow, little shadow. Thank you, thank you. Welcome in. You're now my little sapling. Also, guys, if you do explanation point stinky, you can see how stinky you are today. Um, so A if you would like... moments later... If you would like to check that, we are right now deciding what item we want to keep when we die. Uh, I'm not... I feel like holding on to the liver might be good, because the liver was hard to obtain. 18% stinky, not bad. Not so bad. Spoo Spooka? Spooka, welcome in. We already have the thing that allows me to save 10 coins. Maybe we want... Maybe What do we want to save? I feel like nothing is worth saving, but everything is worth saving. I mean, this ring is pretty good. Let's save that. You know what? Let's do that. I will regret that. I will regret that. Oh, we found the witch. No. Okay. We have to be careful because we can't lie. Ah, oh, Nightingale. I'm so sorry for earlier misunderstanding. Wow. She burned me. She burned me. And now she's all like, oh, it was a misunderstanding. Ba, 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 ba. It wasn't. Oh, Spock, would you prefer if I call you Spock then? Um, may the, I, I was gonna say may the force be with you, but it's like that's Star Wars, not Star Trek. My God, I, I don't wanna lose my nerd credit. I know, I know nerdy things. Uh, I am the first witch and I run the Sorora Order of the in Intimidates. The filthy wrench and I, though, miraculously often have rather horrendously experiment have come to an understanding about the dream. 
Do I though? I don't know. I don't know, Rag. I I know that Spock does that little V thing with his fingers. Either may the force be with you or live long and prosper. There we you go. Can only it was pick one to say. It was live long and prosper. That's what I was thinking of. But then the may the force be with you popped to my head first. <gasps> yeah, Lily. This is really interesting. So it's a side scrolling a uh, roguelike horror game where you can attack monsters, hide from monsters, you can find items. You can also unlock slots that allow you to keep items when you die. There are certain items you find that you will keep when you die. I don't know how to level up, but it's also kind of low-key like Dark Souls. There's dodging and there's no parrying. Not yet. <gasps> you love lo roguelikes? Nice. What's your favorite one? How do we train you? This will sound a bit macabre. The blood and essential organs of the dreams. Is it not macabre? 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 Oh, it's macabre. <laughs> Disclaimer, Raiders. I have very bad dyslexia. I have very bad dyslexia. Dark politics, we were talking about favorite roguelikes, not favorite Dark Souls games. But if you wanted to answer favorite Souls games, then you can do that too. Thoughts on strawberries? I love strawberries. They're like one of my favorite berries. That's okay. That's okay. Neota? I've never heard of Neota. Mine would be um, Hades, but I'm pretty new to, to roguelikes. Um, essence in the bill holds you tremendous eat a power. Of berries before you go to sleep. I would if I had the money to. By effort, uh, offering them in a ritual the ent entity that controls the dream, the the body may be permanently enhanced. <gasps> Wait, she's teaching me how to level up. Furthermore, worthy inmates are granted special gifts as they ascend through the ranks. In fact, you will receive a special gift after your very first offering. Here in the haunting guide and offering list you can can refer to. I look forward to collaborating with you and unlock your full potential, Nightingale. Offering. Okay, five coin and one corrupted finger. <gasps> See, this is why it's like Dark Souls as well. Because you can like add your stats. So we can add life. We could add curse tolerance. We could add immunity. Interesting. So those are the only things we can do. Who's my favorite mod? Hands down, Lombax. Lombax is my favorite mod. Lombax is my favorite mod. <laughs> David's just like, what? Yes, Lombax does the most modding stuff for me. David, you're, you're great, but you're not modding. <laughs> they all know Lombax is my favorite mod. <laughs> Rar, what do you mean? Polygon's new! I'm sending you a message. Wait, wait. Where's my plug mods? I'm sending you a message to send Cabby. Okay, send send mods. If you're in the Discord, you can also start a ticket tool if you want to send me a message too. Also, speaking of... Speaking of, guys, you should join my Discord. I post stupid stuff on there. It's really fun. Okay, we're doing... Oh, I'm now level one! Yay! Congratulations on your first offering. Your reward is a key that unlocks an, our network of secret passages! Hell yeah. Bookshelf in the room connecting directly to another part of the house. Very convenient. Our next reward will be at level five. An advanced grimoire that will let you create new spells. <gasps> I look forward to your next offering. Wait, we can do another offering, guys. We can you level up again. up until now? What is wrong with you? What do you mean? We didn't we didn't know about it. We could level up again. Let's I'm 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 loving let's let's do that. I'm I was gonna go all health, but I'm like, okay. Okay, we need we already used the corrupted heart. We need another corrupted heart. Okay. That's okay. That's okay. We'll be back. We'll be back, ladies. You need to bring a new knight 
uh, begin a new night of the target will re revive in the haunt once more. Yeah, so the corrupted heart was the big lady. I have to kill the big lady again. Yeah, it's 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 very different than a lot of other games and a lot of different roguelikes. I, I think it's really unique and interesting. I really highly recommend it. If you're looking for a good roguelike and you like spooky games, this game. Dying is one way to start a new night, but uh, search for another blue bookshelf and I'll find might find a different way. Oh. The curse is a glimpse in the tra traumatized heart of the dream. Within a heightened perception, may strange and wonderful truths be revealed. I guarantee there's stuff that's only going to be revealed if you're cursed. One may even locate a gateway between the dispatched worlds. You might try gazing into a mirror while terribly cursed. It's the only way to meet the man in the mirror. Oh. I do hope you come to appreciate the mad artistry of whatever Celeste entries controls the dream. Be careful around the other innates. Some have lost their minds and others have turned their back on the sorrow oral order. The casting spell of becoming repeatedly cursed takes a toll on sanity. I mean, wouldn't it take anything a, a toll if you were being repeatedly cursed? <laughs> this one requires you to find certain items to level up. Welcome in, Dave. Only the truly strong-willed can um, ascend the ranks of the order. I recommend strengthening your tolerance to the curse to avoid any issues. That's probably good at first switch. I was once a stranger to the dream like you. My title is a accurate. I, I don't know. It says accurate. At this point, since the game is taking place in a dream and a mental asylum at the same time, who has gone insane? Those who are insane say I. I mean, we're all insane. I'm lazy, uh, extra steps. Uh, Polly can be my middleman, but... <laughs> That's okay, use Polly as your middleman, Dark Politics. I appreciate it. Uh, after learning the occult arts from the Filthy Wrench, I became the, the dream's first true witch. Can I also become the first witch? I want to. I believe I am still alive in the real world, although it, it becomes harder and harder to know for sure. It doesn't matter how much much to me because I have so much important work to do here. The Filthy Wrench and I are collaborating on an experiment of sort. Though careful application of offering blood and permanent changes can be made in the dream. We are still in our early research. I'll be sure to let you know. Okay, that's it. We're done talking to her. <gasps> Thank you. This is my gremlin form, by the way. <laughs> Spock, well, come in. Thank you for the follow. You're now my little sapling. Downside to late raids. Yeah, go to sleep. But we can use the secret passage. I wonder where it's going to take me. Let's go. Wait. I'm in the strange bedroom. We're all going to be back here. Mia's tired now. Nighty night losers. Good night, infinite sweet dreams. We are back here. Wait, we can go in here and we can we can craft spells and stuff. We need some more protection. Um, I still don't know how I feel about the red ones, but we can make a few dummy spells. Do, do, do. I need to start setting up. No, that's not what I want. I need to start setting up the other side. With like stuff. Right? Well, that, not that. We'll put, we'll put these on the other one here. There we go. Ah, there we go. Good night. Sweet dreams. So the other dude, the, the dude we saved is now in the study. You think he killed Margaret? I just feel like he killed Margaret. Oh, he's just hanging out. He's kind of creepy. And his eyes bugging at me. But he might give me something cool. Uh, good to see you again. 
Now that we're free, Horace and I would like to offer you a special service. As I understand it, the witch in the basement is always looking for offering, fingers, heart, and sort of things. I don't know much about witchcraft myself, but I know how to procure these offerings. You see, Horace and I have skilled hunters always in search of our next target. Oh, so you just let me know if you'd like us to go hunting and I'm sure we can make a deal. Ooh. So basically, I could be like, go do this. I... Excellent, we'll be right back. He went and killed the lady even though she was dead already. Here we are. Pleasure doing business with you. <gasps> oh, cool! That's cool. What's my CPU? I'm wondering. Uh, Damon, what's my CPU? At 13900K. If that makes sense. 13900K. 99K? Oh, I9 13900K. Now we can also add more vigor. <gasps> Lily, you are new here. Welcome in. My name is Camellia. I'm a forest witch variety streamer. You can call me Cammy. I like to play Ookie Spooky Games and Souls Like. Make yourself at home. Now we need another corrupted heart and 10 strength. Okay, okay. But that's cool that with coins we can. We can get him to do stuff for us. Okay. We're still not 100% done with the area here. We still have stuff to find. We haven't got into that room. Apparently, we're missing something in here still. Oh, here. Oh, we got a scone. And Gaul, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not acknowledging. Gull, you said you have this game on PlayStation. Did you, like, play it? So, Servant Quarter C. Gull, just a friendly reminder for everyone watching. Make sure to like and subscribe on YouTube and follow on Twitch. Crawl, love, crawl. Apparently, I can't. That's so annoying. Okay. So, apparently there's still something in the storage I missed. <gasps> Hi, Captain Fourleaf! Oh, there we go. I got coffee! Yay! I like coffee. I like me some coffee. Pancakes! Ooh, You know what? Pancakes sound good. Wait, wasn't there a room that we could see a number? Do we have to be corrupted to see the numbers? Oh shit, we might have to be corrupted to see the numbers. Oh no, one's here. Six. Sweet Millie, dead girl. The dark almost seer. Our number games. West to east in white lead. The other two are where we lay our heads. Our number game. West to east is white lead. What is what is west? What how would we know what's west? Ooh! <gasps> Top hat! Wait, 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 guys, 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 guys. Oh yeah, we have a hat now. There we go. So we got it. West is left. I guess that makes sense. So if we're looking at it, it would be left to. So left. So whatever number is the most left will be the first number. What do we got? Chance of having damage. There we received? go. I think we're making pretty good progress. Oh, yeah. So this is where we have to put the number on. Okay. Okay. We have two more rooms to search, and then we have to figure out. I want to. A I feel like we're activating a, a, a spell, but I'm not quite. feel like I don't quite need it yet, so we'll hold out. Oh no, guys. Oh no, guys. Oh, a three. 
Is it 362? Was the first number we saw two or was that this before I died? Oh, the, I don't like this thing. Wait, we need to use the protection spell. This dude here. Wait, you know what we could. Wait. We, oh, fuck you. You know what we could also do, guys? We always forget that we have this. We could do that. And then he should be paralyzed. Yeah! How be dear person? Dear person, be good. How be you, person? Okay, so we know... We know it's 3-6. Okay, so there must be another number at the beginning here. Right, guys? 3-6, and then something else. I feel like it was 2. Oh, 4. 3-6-4. All this vomit is keeps on... Corrupting me when I step on it. Three, six, four. Ah, uh, I don't feel like I need health yet. Oh, sapling. Oh, sapling. Wait. Yes. It's bright now. It's bright now. It's all bright. Oh my god, soda pop. Let's peek up ahead. Oh, wrong door. Question is what's here? This is- Oh, this is the kitchen! Moonless path connects in present light to the candle open the path. As long as you do not leave this room, death will return to this- thing. Okay. Is this a boss? Is this gonna be a boss, guys? This feels like a boss. Well, we'll find out. Hold on. Hold on. Where are my candles? There we go. Let's place it. I'm not gonna die, though. Hi, Colossal Mon! How you doing? Guess we talked to him. Sapling, Cammy's magic is potent, but my mischievous energy adds a unique spark to our dynamic. Together, we create a whirlwind of chaos, laughter, and magic that enchants all sad. around us. Are all these eggs from sapling? What are you talking about? Maybe. Is that the lore? You... Ah, you must be the new boy. Boy, I'm a girl. Just so you're aware, the last... Wait. Am I a boy or a girl? Hi, Song. I was so sure I'm a girl. So you're aware that the last boy died of Epsis. He did not listen carefully to our instructions. The patient is dying. I need you to run to the laboratory and craft a tonic jar. I have a tonic jar. You might be just be of some use, boy. Butcher. I do have a name, of course, but I'd rather not sully a reputation in the real world. Finding work has been difficult for an old-fashioned craftsman like myself, so I've had to do things I'm not proud of. I thought I was a girl, but I guess Nightingale works for either. I guess Nightingale works for either. I thought I was like an Alice-style girly girl. That bloody fool, Joseph listened, listener. But he could be calling everybody boy, you know what I mean? I mean, I think I'm 15. Has turned the art of the surgery into a complete farce. Um, Dr. 
Black had offered me to top pay for a simple job. Each night I was to deliver in fresh corpses and dissect them. He claimed he wanted to start a medical school, but there was no students. The bodies were to be... I don't even know what this word is. Anatomized? 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 I don't know. An what? Anatomized? What does the word anatomized mean? I've never heard it before. In front of a curious window, the observer clocked in the shadow. A few nights later, when I awoke in the dream, the truth was made clear. I had been hired to introduce the dream to the mechanical operations of the human body. Set up for atomical review, separating out labels of the organs. Oh, thank you, Bobo. I didn't even know that was a thing. Now I stay on assisting Dr. Black. Kit, yes, but performing my own very investigation as well. Dream. The dream affords me to a rare opportunity to study the human body in exact, exacting details. Each night the, the dead are reanimated anew, so one can truly practice in a way impossible to the real world. When I first arrived in the dream, I performed many any experiment on willing objects. Well, mostly willing. I think progress requires sacrifice, no? I know it's dissecting, but I didn't know what, like, what kind of dissecting. For an instant, I spent a few weeks slicing one gentleman's Achilles tendon in a different way each night. Wow. As you can imagine, he grew stark, raving mad. But by the end, I was able to consistently repair that hobbled foot. Don't even get me started on what I've learned about the brain. I believe I'm still alive in the real world. And that is a few more nights I'll... All awake as usual. Initially, I had only the faintest memory upon waking, but over time, I learned to retain more. As soon as I wake up, I pick up a scaffold and I retrace what I have practiced in the dream. Additionally, I believe there is a way to escape the dream at will. But I certainly won't tell you about it, my little secret. Also, if I ever heard of you sneaking around, Mossy Malazam, I'll cut your eyes out. Whoa. Oh, I see. You're not the new boy. You're a puppet. I'm going to snip your oh, strings. Man. Oh, shit. Boss. Okay, first thing we gotta do is a spell. Ow! He threw a poison knife at me! I don't think I have an antidote. Oh, I do. Oh, shit. He's doing some strong attacks. He is strong, guys. Hold on. He is so strong. What do you mean? I haven't died yet. I haven't died yet. Whoa. Okay, we're just gonna do another puppet. <gasps> oh shit! Come here, child. We're fine, we're fine, we're fine. We're fine, we're fine, guys. He's bleeding out, which is good. And I'm seeing things, ding, which ding, is ding. not good. In this corner weighing exactly, redacted, pounds, Cammy the Witch. In the other corner, at about 300 pounds, Jason first fight. Ga. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, exactly. Ow! He keeps on poisoning me! Oh, we're both paralyzed. Fuck, it was too close. Come here, child. Shit. 
Shit. Ow! He needs to stop throwing. I'm in danger. I need coffee. Okay, do I have... I have bread. I can eat bread. There we go. We killed it. We did it! First try! Good night, Diamond Miner! Good night! There we go. The right eye to an ancient stone idol. Small glimmering lights to be seen within. Name your prize. We will pay a it. I will find a way to transport this home if it kills me. A tear-shaped drop of blessed blood shed only by those who once made an offering at a remembrance shrine. Can be dropped into a remembrance shrine to remember an additional item. Butcher surgeon. Offered corrupted heart. My father hired him for some... Automation help dreadful man. He required so many items, guys. Look at all my dead puppets. Look at all my dead puppets. Does it have any items here? Nothing to grab. Okay. <laughs> What's back here? Ooh. West basement? West basement. West stairs? We're in the west now. They're all dead. Sapling, scaring Kemi with a mischievous prank sounds fun. I'll create a magical illusion that will surprise her, adding a playful twist to our magical bond. Let Yee. the mischief begin. Yee, a mischief. Mischief madness. We'll put that in for now, because those items are useful. Because we never know when we need that. I think that's the only thing that's worth remembering. I hate to ask this of you, but I don't want to waste your hours mod... Putting something for you if you don't want to play. I was going to ask if you could try Noita at the end of stream or at some point. Mm, yeah, I'll, I'll, get, I'll try to try it out sooner than later. Okay, Dark? Mm. I'm a kitten! Welcome in! Welcome in! The strays are invading your stream. Meow, 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 meow. Welcome in, readers. Welcome in. How was... Ooh, Tom Clancy? How was Tom Clancy? How was Tom Clancy? Oh. Shit. Oh, guys. At this rate, we're gonna die. Because another lady just popped up. I think that only stops bleed. We don't have anything to heal poison. You know what? Let's just get out of here. Bye. Oh! Oh no, this is so much worse. Oh no, never mind. We're back here. We're back here. Okay, let's just hide here while we welcome raiders. <gasps> welcome in, raiders! Welcome, raiders, to my stream. I am Sapling the <laughs> Almighty Raven. <laughs> you this didn't... is my assistant, a uh, partner. Camellia the Forest You Witch. didn't commit war crimes? Mm, sure, sure. But welcome. And if you're new here, my name is Camellia. I'm a Forest Witch variety streamer. I like to play ooky spooky games and souls like it. Right now we're playing an ooky spooky roguelike. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So it looks like that side connects to the west staircase. That's interesting. We still don't have the camera, so that's not a good way to go. We need more health items. So we need to go back. I know what we need to do, guys. We need to actually go back down. We need to go back down to the study, and we need to make more healing items. Can we? Oh, yeah. 
Speaking of which, we could also heal ourselves. Do we want to heal ourselves or do we want more tolerance? I don't know. I'm so un I'm so indecisive of what I want. I'm so like, well, if we heal a lot, then well, I should add a tolerance. Okay, we need a human finger. Okay. We'll go back this way. And then the laboratory is right here. We can make something. Yes, please go do after stream care. Please, please, please. Thank you so much for sharing your community. Get yourself some food. I also need food. I also be hungry. Okay, can we craft some healing items? We can. Okay. I really like those. Those have been nice. The paralysis jars, I really like. So at least now we have some health. We can go this way through... Apparently we've missed something in the server room. But that's where there's like a bunch of enemies, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah. I don't think it's worth it to go fight those guys, honestly. We can go through the kitchen again. Into the basement. Yay, five more minutes! I mean, like, it's weird, because I, I feel like I feel fine, but at the same time, like, I definitely feel like it could be. We can't see him yet. We have to be more crazy. But I, it says I'm missing something down here. Like, whoa. Oh, there. <gasps> pipe! We got another pipe, guys. Okay. We have... Fuck, you know what we forgot to do? We forgot to make a protection spell. We forgot to go make spells. Hold on. We'll go back and make spells. Because we need a protection spell. It's dangerous. It's dangerous to go without a spell. She's in the wine cellar. So we can go this way through the wine cellar back into my room. I, I, wish, I wish I could make stuff here in the wine cellar. But I have to go all the way back to the cult. Luckily, the setup on this run is really good. Oh, I don't have any blue wax. No. I guess we can make some of these red ones. We have no... I Oh, we're out of blue wax. Also, while we're up here, I want to go talk to the marble man. See if there's anything else that we might need. Oh, I'm way too close to him. What does he have? So we we already have those things. Why is that so expensive? I have 36 coins. Okay, what is this? A blackened ring. Okay, so these are like... Ooh, interesting. Fire damage. I'm gonna buy... Oh, that's a lot. That's expensive to buy a med kit. We could actually buy some blue wax here too. Not actually not bad. We have five. It's actually not bad at all. We can make some protection spells this way. Max curse tolerance. That also seems useful. We should also grab one first aid kit. Okay. Now we can go back to the call room. I'm just now I've gone this far. I'm I'm sad to it saddens me to think about dying, but it's gonna happen inevitably. I still don't know what the clock does and why ringing what ringing to midnight does, but perfect. I'm worried that I bought if I buy too many, I'm gonna regret it as well. Shortcut. Thank you, lady. Here. One day we'll go into that servant room and find out if there's anything useful in there. Go through the kitchen. I also think that they would have allowed me to try the boss over and over again until I left the room. Okay. Where did she go? Yourself a knight. 
Can you die? She doesn't want to die, guys. Oh, I, I can see her. Oh, you know what? She's not, like, completely gone. She just goes invisible. Oh, wait. It won't let me go through there? Wait. What does my quest say I need to do? Find another blue bookshelf. Secret passage. Find a way to meet the main man in the mirror. Find a use for the red... White... Uh... Oh my god, right idle eye. Hmm. We can talk to Margaret. Okay, we need to talk to Margaret. So this loops back around in here, but there's no point going that way. It's too dangerous. So let's go that way. Okay. At least she's dead. And won't be a problem for us anymore. Go back this way. It's nice that it's no longer dark in here. And we'll go talk to Margaret. Margaret's in the study. I think we have to go to the maze, and I think there's a statue there that needs the eye, the eye placed there. That's what I'm thinking. So I'm pretty sure I remember there's something like that there. That dude's hanging out. Where's Margaret? There she is. She'll know more. Thank you for rescuing Felix and Horace. Horace? <laughs> horse. Oh my god. I'm not sure who locked them up, but I have my suspicions. Also, you've met the first witch. Be cautious around her. She is highly secretive and exhorts a high degree of control over her in a in a natives? In natives is that the word? I always want to read it as initiatives or as inmates. Also, you've killed the butcher son. That tremendous dude, I'm not one to celebrate the death of a fellow human being, but the butchers wasn't quite human, was he? You should proceed at once to the mo mo uh, Mosty Mausoleum. The object you found is must for the key. The mausoleum can be found deep in the hedge maze. Okay. Some of the paths through the maze may be invisible to the naked eye. You'll need to be significant curse to see through the illusion. Sorry, but I can't respond to that. <laughs> it's too inappropriate for sapling! Apparently. Okay. So apparently we need to be significantly cursed. Okay, we know what we need to do next. Okay. I don't know how we should raise our curse level. Oh my god, that was loud, Damon. What are you playing? We need to figure out a way to increase our curse level. I guess if I just activate puppets and stuff, it should it should curse. It should curse if I activate puppets. See, he has the eyeball there. Okay. Oh, that also increases my curse level. Never mind, guys. We can just increase our curse level this way. So we start seeing things. I know, sometimes the, the TTS is not liking it. Is that enough? For us to start seeing the right things that we need to see? Oh. What does that do? Does the eyeball mean the right way? I'm assuming eyeball is good, or is that where we came from? No, we didn't come that way. Oh shit, oh shit. Okay, okay. Oh no, guys. He... He wants to hurt me. There we go. He wants to burn me alive. Why did I roll twice? It's fine, it's fine. Oh 
shit. Oh shit, everything wants to kill me, guys. Oh, this way. Everything wants to kill me. There's no safe place. Oh, this way. Oh no, big boy. Oh no, oh no, we're just running, we're just running, we're hoping for the best. Oh shit, 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 shit. I don't want to fight big boys, not yet, I'm not ready. Oh my god, fire dudes, fire dudes. Oh wait, item. Permanent he heavy hot. Wait, heavy headwear, a foul smelling pumpkin that is the bottom removed so it can be worn as a helmet. Worn once. Good night, Razel. Good night, sweet dreams. Thank you for hanging out. Once worn for the Shanmai celebration by an initiative and forgotten about. Receive 25% less poison build out. Ooh, so it reduces my speed. Interesting. Oh. Oh, I don't got a spectral remain. I wonder what happens if I unlock this. No. There's a portal. I don't want to die. Not yet. Where am I? Oh, it's a boss. This is going to be a boss, guys. I'm not liking this. But let's see. Oh, fuck. I'm cursed. I'm cursed! I really need to put a candle as... Okay, we're fine. Okay, we're fine, we're fine. We're just gonna reduce the curse a little bit. Oh, she looks cool! A fresh face! You look about the same age as me! Your face still looks intact, though. I think my body must be rotting in reality and why my face is the first to go in the dream. My name's Emma, not that it makes... M matters much. I'll make wake you. I'll make you a deal. Bring an enchanted seal, and I'll help you break into the mausoleum. You going to look like what's inside. Trust me. The first witch can teach you how to make your own enchanted spells. Alternatively, there might be a few scrolls shattered around the hedge maze if you're looking hard enough. I don't have one. Shit. Come back when you're ready. Fuck. So I guess we can't. I guess we can't go that- do that thing. Oh, that's the way you can hide. Interesting. So we're in the mall- So we made it through the- The maze, so that's good to know. Wait. That was freaky. Apparently I'm not insane enough. That's not good. Let's just get a little more insane. I want to go into the mirror. We're in nowhere. Change the pho photograph. Yes, you haven't any photograph on display. Okay. I guess we can display photographs. Oh. We have another... Oh, we have another remember thing unlocked. We now have six. What do we want to remember? What do we want to remember? Maybe some house stuff? Maybe not. What do we want to remember? Some thingies? Acid? Any of these rings we like? I guess we could do a brass telescope. Here's the candle, you say. Well, the candle. Uh, mm, I don't feel like I need to remember the candle. It's something that I can remember so when I die, I keep it. You know what I mean? So something that I see as valuable. Blue wax. There we go. 
I like blue wax. Oh, there's an ad happening. I'm gonna take this opportunity to go pee, guys. Because it's now been more than two hours. And I, I, my pee is strong, whole, gone stronger. So I'll be right back. Yes, I'll make a video where it's just the highlights of the stream of me criticizing everybody's organization skills. Guys, be prepared. There's a surprise. I found an asset! Look at these! Look at them! 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 Aren't they so cute? <laughs> they are so adorable. I'm absolutely in love. I am now a sucker for switch. Oh! <gasps> Guys, I want this backpack. Can I? Can I please? <gasps> I want, I want, I want this backpack and the froggy plushie. Does this game have merch? Oh, I know. We want to put the diary under the pillow. There we go. We're safe. We got to keep that diary safe from diary readers. So they don't find out about all the secrets and the crush on Tommy, you know? <gasps> can I put... Oh, I can put Mr. Oinkers. Okay, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Okay, there we go. That's better. Five stars. Ten out of ten. Is there a ranking? <laughs> Water and food go down the same tube. Mm, I don't agree with that. I don't agree with that. Food is down a different tube. Food do it on the other one. <laughs> but what about water? Water can go down the other one. I like hydrating, so I don't mind. I don't mind hydration spam. I guess some people just don't want to go pee a billion times a day. I'm all for the peeing all the time day. Life. Oh, look at this furry fan art. I wonder if she did it. I wonder if she drew the furry fan art. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. I just realized something. There's a bathroom. Hoop. Bras. Guys, look away. Look away. This is inappropriate. Don't watch. Look away. What is this? Underwear. Guys, look away. Don't look at her panties. She has pink panties. You don't want to look at that. More underwear? How much underwear do you got, girl? What are you planning to do? Here we go. So many underwear. More panties? God, I don't have that many panties. I know, it's it's her fault for having so- Look at that, that video had my old, old model on it. My old, with my old, old face. Still have 30 seconds left of the ad. Hold on, I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna wait. Ba-dum, ba-dum. Ba-dum, ba-dum, ba-dum. Ba seconds. What's the fishy game that I play? I don't remember. Paz was asking me the name. I have to look it up. Five, four, three. I mean, half of you guys could not be in the ads anymore. Welcome back. Now you look familiar. No, I suppose not. I haven't had a visitor in a while and I guess I'm overexcited. My name is Rose. Rose? Spooky, is this you? Don't remember much else but my first name. So that we'll have to do. Don't take this the wrong way. But you seem like the type of girl... Okay, girl! That carries these around a lot of junk she doesn't need. Am I right? I love junk. It's the only thing that keeps me sane in this starry purgatory. Well, somehow, what's sane? Better than Mr. Photographer over there, at least. I've got a heaping mound of coins. If you have any extra items, I'm happy to take them off your hands. <gasps> oh, you can sell shit to him. That's cool. So you can sell things you don't want, like rings you're not gonna use. Because I'm gonna die anyway, you know? I have so many coins, though. If I die, so many coins go bye-bye. But I can use it to buy hell stuff, so I don't go bye-bye. I have so many coins. I don't want that. Guys, I have 76 coins. Thank you for the lurk, Lily! Now that you're better acquaintance, I have something for you. Picking the perfect look for a giant pile of outfits and rings takes time. To instantly recall your best assemble bully, you should write it down in this fashion record. I used to have more records, but I've get I've given them all. Maybe you'll find them. Multiple records means multiple looks at your fingerprints. Fashion 
compassionately young women like us need all the help we can get. Rose is a young woman. I need somebody to take I need to take a screenshot of this beautiful fashionable lady and send it to Spooky. <gasps> he has a crow, look! Ah, new arrival. It has been a while. I'd introduce myself, but I'm afraid I've forgotten who I was. One visitor gave me the horrific Lord Nobody of Nowhere. I quite like that title. I'm afraid to find out who I was before. Perhaps I wasn't a good person. I still faintly remember things, smells, tastes, and uncanny sense of having seen something before. That's why I enjoy photographs. They bring back so many feelings. Have you ever seen a camera? It's quite simple, really. If you'd like it, I'll have a beautiful antique camera for sale. <gasps> I'll give it to you for free, but I need coins. You see, I cannot leave this place, so I purchase, purchase photos from a, a buddy phot photographer such as yourself. As such, you'll be able to make the back the purchase price of the camera in no time, I'm sure. Let's buy. <gasps> Wait, he has outfits! So this here gives me five... This is a simple uh, muslin dress with floral pattern. It has five plus health, five plus curse tolerance, five plus bleed tolerance, five plus poison tolerance. Poison tolerance, 5 plus max paralysis tolerance, and 10 plus co coin discoverability. It received 2% less physical damage, and it reduces my speed a little bit. So this is like kind of heavy. This one's really heavy. Permanent. Oh, very light. Received 25% less bleed buildup. <gasps> Slightly increases luck. Ooh. Permanent tool. Camera. We bought the camera! We might as well buy some film while we're at it, too. How much is the Bible? 11. We're gonna buy this. Um, We still have 30 coins. We'll keep the coins. Since you have a camera, I've gotten a favor to ask. My photograph collection is solely lacking photos of the supernatural variants. Sell me a photo of your spirit and I'll throw them in a special extra gift. Ooh. They normally can only be seen when you cur when you're cursed, but you can take a photo of them anytime. You have to take photos of ghosts. Basically. Oh, can't go that way. Takes me to nowhere. Yes, we leave. Oh, we can choose where we want to leave. It's like a fast travel area almost. We can go back to the basement or we can go to the storage room on the ground floor. That's cool. You can basically go back to any mirror area you've been. A tissue, a tissue, we all fall down. Let's equip our new outfit. We also got this new hat, which is slightly heavier too. This current hat receives five plus poise. Well, this one receives less poise buildup, which I don't know what poise buildup is. So this one, see, this one is pretty good, but it actually reduces my speed quite a bit. I'm surprised. 15% damage from melee attacks from behind. Ooh, I look cute. Now you can't tell me I'm not a girly poo. <gasps> Hi, holy shrimp. Now you can't tell me I'm not a girly poo. I have a dress. I'm pretty. I'm so pretty. How far did we get? In, um... Our levels. Level four. So, so far we've done... We've played it... F oh, two hours and 41 minutes. I'm doing good. No, it's not. I did 25 kills, found 507 items and four deaths. My current night is my longest at one hour and 13 minutes. Time spent hiding one minute. Kills 12. And items found 228. So we found most stuff. 
You can actually see like our damage projectile and our physical resistance. Everything, our stats, everything. <gasps> You're hungry. Speaking of hungry, I am also hungry. We can also see controls, shrine, and hauntings. Oh. The hedge mage has a spectral remaining. <gasps> you got a camellia! Yes! And the, we got our beast theory, so we can see all the guys we killed. Apparently, we killed eight out of 89. That's so many. Oh, these are clues. Boiler room clues. I didn't even know they saved up here. And then we got the different things. Everything saves here. That's so cool. That's so cool. Save the game and quit. Yes. Hoggy Woggy. How many times? Upwards of, I don't know, like maybe close to 10 times. Mm -hmm. 10 times, Pedro. Impressive. <laughs> it's so impressive. So impressive. Hold on. I am hungry, guys. I want, I would love to play it forever, but I am absolutely starved. I feel like I haven't eaten much at all. And I didn't. So I didn't eat enough. I really, really, truly didn't. And I um, I need to eat. No. Throwing eggs in my face that are uncooked and smelly and properly rotten is not the solution, guys. Ow. It's not the solution. But don't worry. Tomorrow is Monday. Um, and usually on Monday, we've been watching videos. So we're going to do another chill stream Monday night. It's going to be a little bit later than usual. 6.30 p.m. PST, and we'll be watching some more videos. I know, right? I've only had two pee breaks, right, Bobo? So, yeah, yeah. I'm also going to be posting their schedule. Um, uh, Hopefully, we'll beat Sekiro on Wednesday, and we'll do more Monster Hunter on Saturday. And hopefully, once we... I want to play more of this game as well. So, I definitely want to do it. Mm, mm, mm. I actually want to um, raid into Cereza. Um, she's right at the boss of Resident Evil. And I want to show her some support. She never streams the same time as me usually, so we can go do that. Oh, look who's, look who shows up now, beautiful Spooky. <laughs> Welcome in, Spooky. You missed it. There was a lady called Spooky in the game. She looked exactly like you. That's okay. You need sleep. You need rest. You're tired. I'm happy you went to bed. I was hoping you went to bed. Bed is important. Importante. No, Spooky needs sleep, guys. Spooky needs lots of sleep. She is tired. But also, guys, if you're not already following my socials, go follow my socials. There's stuff on there and things like that. Go check that out. Um, Stream tomorrow. We're going to go raid Theresa. She's playing Resident Evil, another spooky game. Um, and I'm going to go find some food. I am absolutely starving. Oh, why does sleeping on your desk feel so much better than sleeping on your actual like bed? I feel like it's like falling asleep on your sofa feels more comfortable than falling asleep in your bed. You're just like, it's like when you're trying to watch a movie and you're just like, can't keep your eyes open. You're just like ready for bed. And then as soon as you, as soon as you like lay into bed and you decide to turn off the TV, you're like, I can't sleep anymore. Ugh. But I, speaking of sleep, I need to go eat and sleep. Have a lovely night, everybody. Happy raiding. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Auf Wiedersehen. Tschüss. Bye-bye.